I almost forgot to do it again, folks. I forgot to unplug my microphone and plug it back in. Hi, everyone! My hair is fluffy because you know what I did today? I put product in and I air, hair dried it. Whoop. That makes it go whoop. No, I wash it every day. It's July 29, 2022. And if you can believe it. Friday once again. <laughs> Happy fucking Friday, everybody. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I fucking I'm so listen. I'm so proud of myself for putting that together. And I'm so happy that Kit triggered it again today. When it was actually supposed to trigger and uh when it when it was updated. Mad, that was uh David Lynch, uh famous director, wishing us a uh, happy Friday, along with uh Kiryu Kazuma and uh Majima Goro. I don't I don't know what's uh I don't know what's what's so strange about that. Uh they they love all of us personally. We are all personal friends of David Lynch. Why wouldn't he come on and, and wish us a, a happy Friday, July 27th, or tw July 29th, 2022. Uh, let, me, let me bring, um, let me bring everybody else back in here really quick. Um, friend of the stream, David Lynch, obviously. You know, James Buffet is a personal friend of Mac stream, the personal friend of, of this stream is David Lynch. Yeah, that's where I got my fluffy hair from, actually. David Lynch is my uh, real dad. <laughs> Ooh, oh, hello, hi. friend. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> we were just sitting here. We were yeah. sitting here waiting for you to, you know, yeah. like the 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 lunch. Lunch. Listen, uh, I was, I was, I was uh, vibing there for a second and then Kate caught me off guard with a with the Friday Night Funks. <laughs> Friday Night okay. Funkin'. I, I guess that's what they call it. Hi everybody, how are you all? Hi guys. Oh, this we is were, just a... we were in We were in like, you know, our little playpen and then Kit's finally let mm -hmm. us out now, I guess. <laughs> yeah. I did. Yeah. You are all little creatures in a, in a, in a pin and uh, you stay there until I uh, lift up the, the gates and then you rush out like the bulls. Um, Oh, that just that's not Italy. what happens. I I don't. I'm not. I <laughs> listen. That's not what happens. <laughs> Wait, that's not what happens when they release what? the bulls in Italy, or that's not what happens no, when I bring insane. you onto the stream. For once, what oh, not one Italy, one Spain. <laughs> You're secondly, so right. That was me. Secondly, that was me. If you think that we stay in that pen the entire time before uh -huh. legally bulls happens, you've got another no, wait, thing no, coming. Wait, no, don't don't tell. No, you're don't there always. The secret club. Oh, of course, yeah. I know about the brochromony. <laughs> <laughs> I know about the secret society that you all founded without me explicitly. Uh, <laughs> no, you, don't. you don't have to hide it. It's not a secret Sometimes society anymore. You need to let your friends do their own thing. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, like mill about in the pin before I uh, raise up the gate, like the running of the bulls. <laughs> you don't mill about. We have secret meetings on how to uh -huh. overthrow you. Uh huh. I'm sure the bulls do too. How well is that working for them? Right, <laughs> actually. I mean, sometimes they gore people. <laughs> well, that's the people's <laughs> fault, not the bulls. <laughs> I mean, yeah. Exactly, yeah. so it is your fault, that's true. I yeah. need to acquire some Hawaiian shirt so I can twin with Kit. Yes, you do. Do it. Uh, yeah, the drink is textured today. My new, my latest and greatest uh, uh, mixology trick is instead of putting actual ice cubes in there that will eventually water down the drink, I've been putting frozen fruit in the drink uh, that matches the, the flavors of the drink. Um, so then mm. it keeps it cold, and then eventually at the end I have a snack that I can fish out. Um, and eat. Ooh. So yeah. I highly recommend this trick. It's very good. Hi. Okay, I said hi. Now I'm going to watch Back in the Red Hot Chili Peppers. Have a great night. Love you all. 
Have a great time, Jerry and Carmen. Uh, everybody wish them yeah. uh, well. They're going to go fucking see the hot, red hot chili peppers Ooh. live. Have fun. Like, bruh, I'm Have jealous. Fun. Have so much fun. Please tell us how it went. Please tell us if you get any cool merch. I'm always jealous yeah. of people's like, band Take merch. pictures. Yeah. Also, Deej, I feel like with honey, all fruit is good with honey. Hon honey is... Mm. Honey. I mean, here. <laughs> uh, well, okay, but here's the thing: is this that is all fruit? Take. Is all fruit is good with take. honey whiskey? Because that's what DJ is referring <laughs> to. My my misadventures in trying to find a standard drink that I could make with the honey whiskey that I keep buying, thinking this will be the time. I swear. And every time I put it in a fruit juice, I'm like, <laughs> not literally, but. <laughs> Oh, and also, Matt, I did just... Ren told me about the the event, and then I just looked at the memes, and all the memes are choice. All of them. They're good. <laughs> These are all so good. <laughs> are all so honestly, good. My Ren. favorite... My favorite was the the is this a pigeon? <laughs> that yeah. that that one was my my yeah. favorite. Ren, if if he ever does something again, and it's more like it it's uncomfortable or something, just show him the memes. Yeah, just be like, I told <laughs> everyone about you. Yeah, <laughs> like, really you can be extremely. I, did. I told everybody. <laughs> you can be extremely homophobic dog at him and be like, I know what you are. <laughs> <laughs> Which means a vampire. Uh, in the memes uh, channel in the Discord, Becca uh, Ren had a had a classmate who, after um, knowing her for like half a class, oh, maybe not even, decided to ask her out <laughs> oh, yeah. via DMs in the, in the, the class, class while in the, the lecturer was talking. <laughs> yeah, yeah, like it was. <laughs> <laughs> and, wow. Uh, like, like, you didn't ask me before when we were learning about Word and PowerPoint because I know how to do that shit. Like, I was, I was, um, because tape is all about like the basics, basics, right? And, mm. um, and I had been explicit in class that I had never really used Excel. So I was looking how to, like, looking forward to that part of the lesson because I'm like, oh, yeah, I've never really seen it demonstrated to me. I want to be there for this. And it's during that part that this motherfucker. <laughs> yeah. Like, oh, oh this would be Ren, perfect time. I, I'm going to, I'm going to shoot my shot right now. <laughs> I had that. I had a similar thing that happened to me. Like oh, when no. I was an undergrad, oh. it was like, we were doing a travel study and I was so excited because we got to make our own prints. Ooh. I, and Ooh. for, with like facsimile copper plates from William Blake Ooh. and I was like, oh, this is so cool. I need to make a good impression. I'm at that point I really wanted to be a Blake scholar and I'm still kind of a Blake scholar and I was <laughs> like, ah, I need to do it. And there uh -huh. was a guy on the trip that would like we were friendly and I think he might have liked me. And I was just like so focused on doing well and he went by and he was I think he was trying to flirt and I was just like, go away. Leave. <laughs> go away. I need to I do a good job on this. If yeah, you're not here to help me, then leave. <laughs> yeah. Why is it always that it's it's a classmate when I'm trying to focus? Like I remember I was. I don't know. They can sense four. it. They can sense it. I was in year four and I was trying to focus on the class, and the guy who like famously liked me kept trying to like talk to me. And I'm like, please stop. I want to listen <laughs> to the teacher. <laughs> oh my god. Also, the Shush. first guy to ever hit on me did it right after he made us fail a group project. Oh my god. Oh my god. Wow. Guys, guys really do. I say this like I'm not a guy. Guys really do, though. <laughs> there's, there's a certain the confidence is unearned. Guys. The confidence is unearned. <laughs> that's like, that's like, um... I've seen a lot of people uh, joke, uh, and I, I vibed with this having been a teller. This never happened to me personally, because um, I think when I'm working, I give off too many I want to kill you vibes, or I'm a literal <laughs> robot right now. You, you can't have a human conversation with me. Um, 
Uh, but so many, so many tellers I've seen online say that they've had people come up to like do a bank transaction with them, um, and like shoot their shot right there while the teller has their balance what? pulled up and they're like in the negative <laughs> or like they have like five dollars oh to their God. name and it's like you're gonna you're gonna take me out uh, with what money with my money i can see it right here <laughs> i see you have nothing in fact you, you have, have worse zero <laughs> you're not even making <laughs> a deposit get, is this for you to get a free meal or something like it's like i don't know i i don't know <laughs> if they think that hitting on the teller will make them like pity them because that's not how that works um. no i mean honestly this was actually the first time I've ever been asked on a date like all the other times it's been more of a confession thing and whether or not they're asking me to go out with them is like dependent like d it depends whereas mm -hmm. this was because the first person who was a relative stranger to shoot his shot and why then yeah i don't <laughs> i could not oh say DJ, I'm so glad you give off uh, friendly and patient vibes because my two mm -hmm. my two work sonas are, um, or at least my customer service work sonas are like, uh, I'm a literal automaton right now. Um, I'm going to be inhumanly polite and and nice to you, but in a way that makes you it's very uncanny valley. Like, oh my god, this this isn't a person. This is a conduit. Um, <laughs> or. I'm literally going to kill you. I'm doing this efficiently, um, uh -huh. because I hate you. I'm I'm going to I'm going to <laughs> perform this perform you. this to you know the best right of here? my ability at 110 percent. But it's because I hate you right now. I um, I can see this. I can see both of these yes. very clearly in my. I head. get I, I get very angry sometimes life. at customers yeah. when I'm working in customer service. I'm like, listen, I. I'm here to help you, and that's my job, and I'm gonna do it because otherwise I don't make money and I can't live. But I'm gonna <laughs> fucking kill you. I, I, I like the killing intent is coming off me in waves, like in an anime, you know, when like the characters got oh, like yeah, waves of purple coming <laughs> off of them. That's me. Like you can sense it, and it, all my coworkers are like, oh my god. <laughs> I love that so much. Mm hmm. Uh, how to tell a pregnant lady, I cannot help you with this. Pregnant ladies lose their minds. Pregnant people lose their minds, I swear to God. I feel, yeah. I, like, sometimes, sometimes it's just like, I'm so sorry. Like, they're going through a lot, and I think that's why they just lose their minds at everybody else in public. Uh-huh. <sighs> <laughs> But also to be to be fair to them, <laughs> other people lose their minds around pregnant people. Like, oh my god. I I could not even imagine like being pregnant in public and having people just come up and touch you apropos oh, of man. nothing wow. without even asking. Total strangers. So and I hear this wild. happens all the time. Yes. Like pregnant yes. people are always like it's it's fucking insane as soon as you start showing you know like when you're in your second or third trimester like people at the grocery store will just like touch your stomach and be like oh when are you it's due so and stuff like that and i'm like fucking weird who the That's fuck so fucking weird. there was actually so there was this ad that i saw about online shopping i'm not sure what but like this woman <laughs> who's pregnant who's pregnant bought a top that said hands off of good for her, for her bump not that like, people. But it was a whole ad structured around. Yeah. <clears throat> you know, they were so. Yeah. It's PSA. So funny. I feel like the government should run PSAs. Like, PSA, don't touch pregnant people without asking. Maybe yeah, talk yeah. to them first. <laughs> And probably if they're in public, they don't want to, you don't know them, they don't want you to touch them, even if you have a conversation yeah. first. Like anyone else in yeah. public. Yeah. It's like, like oh. is a stranger. It's like, uh. the or older retiree age guys who are getting surgery. Sometimes they are the sweetest, the pregnant ladies too, but some are not. That's yeah, fair. yeah. Uh. Matt's brain was absent that day <laughs> and every other day. Yeah, what's like the first thing they tell you in kindergarten? Keep your hands to yourself. Yeah. And some people never internalized that. They never did.
I was that kid that internalized every single lesson like that. Like, my mom told me, treat others how you want to be treated, and little two-year-old me was like, all right, mom, you got it. And you then I got did that. it. <laughs> to the point where I got, like, tread over. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Yeah, that's a, that's like, the other thing. I yeah. think they need to part. They this need is the to. The rule about life. <laughs> I think they need to teach the second part of that is like, but don't take shit from people. But oh, yeah, I think yeah. that's hard to teach to a kindergartner too. I guess. Yeah. Never mind. Because then the kindergartner's like, well, I'm not gonna take shit from the teacher, even though sometimes it's shit that they do need to take. Yes. Right. Yeah. Like, not to say that kindergarten teachers are uh, infallible or anything like that. They certainly are. Gosh. Um, but there are a lot of things that children do not want to do that they should do because they're good for them. Yeah. Uh, like so, eating vegetables or uh -huh. uh, not climbing on top of very tall things that they can fall from and die, yep. right? Yep. I should ask my friend in my program. I have many friends in my program, thankfully, but one of my friends in my program, she was a kindergarten teacher before this. And she Ooh. is both like, she has immeasurable patience, is so caring, is so kind, and also has so much anxiety. Uh, so much. Okay, Mad, you scared me for a second. I was gonna say, did y'all know that at least in the States, in a lot of states, cutting someone's hair without their permission is uh, considered assault <laughs> under the law? Hell yeah. Mm, yep. And for a second I was like, wow. Mad! <laughs> Uh, granted, you were in kindergarten, <laughs> but I'm sorry you got in trouble. Yeah, because like she did, I mean, ask she did you ask you. Yeah, yeah. It, it's like it's like, and then I think the teacher needs to have like a constructive conversation about like, okay, I like with the uh, I don't know, I don't know, <laughs> I don't know what I would do as a kindergarten teacher uh, encountering a, a situation where two of my students uh, consensually cut off each other's hair or whatever <laughs> they may i'd be much. like i don't okay <laughs> it was not a good haircut <laughs> <laughs> uh... <laughs> Mad. i see that then i'm like i'm like do they deserve to get in trouble necessarily it's like i don't know that's that's a weird one. That's a weird one. Uh, how how are we all today? I forgot to ask. Uh, I also forgot to say hi to everybody. So hi everybody. <laughs> hi. <laughs> and it's okay. I'm good. I woke up. Basically. Nice. Good. I'm glad you woke up. <laughs> Me yeah. too. <laughs> Better than the alternative. <laughs> As my father says. <laughs> Becca, how were how were uh who, how were your errands with our father, by the way? It was it was fine. Uh, <laughs> they were, uh we didn't we didn't do much. We just went to the store, got some shrimp for Becky's mom. Uh, shrimp. Then then went to deliver said shrimp, and then we uh, picked up pizza. What so kind was, of pizza? Uh, uh Luca's pizza. Uh, Is that the falling flavor? down pizza? No, I don't think so. What's the falling down pizza? The what now? Uh, I don't know. I think it's a. Sh isn't that a Chicago thing? I don't think so. Uh, Ren, there's like a there's a place that my family would occasionally get pizza from, uh, and they their thin crust pizza. They did not do the normal thing where you know like typically thin crust pizza is super crispy, right? Um, mm -hmm. theirs was not, it was just thin and like, so you would, and they, they made them like, they made huge, huge slices. They were huge. So huge. like, you'd pick it up and half, uh, like three quarters of the, the <laughs> pizza would like fall. It would be yeah. like limp. So we called that falling was... down pizza. Um, <laughs> <laughs> it was okay. I'm not really a fan of that. Mostly because A, it's a hassle to eat with your hands. I think pizza should primarily be finger food. You, you should be able yeah. to eat it with one What hand. about Chicago style? Chicago oh, style is different. That's a pie. That's yeah. a, that's what that's they that's mean the, when they call it pizza one. pie. Yeah. Wait, wait, Becca, oh. what flavor? Of what Mad? Kind of pizza? Okay, I won't oh, ask any is, more this questions. Is just, <laughs> this is just cheese pizza because I'm a basic ah. bitch. 
here. I like, I like margarita. I like uh, margarita is good. Um, I like uh, sausage and onion. Ooh, um, yeah. And I, sometimes I if I'm feeling spicy, sausage, onion, and pineapple. Ooh, I love yeah. me some pineapple on pizza. Mm. I like, me too. I like ham and pineapple. The most. I do like pineapple on pizza. I'm I less... Like I'm less a fan of ham, um, but I think that sausage works too because typically it's like pork sausage, so it yeah. wor it works in it like that. Good. Pork's really good with fruit. Mm -hmm. My favorite type mm -hmm. of pizza isn't something that's really made all that much um, because it's not exactly a chain pizza like type. Like it can't be a chain pizza type, I don't think. Um, uh -huh. But it's basically um, like sliced plain chicken, like just poached chicken a bit like in slices mm -hmm. and it's on the pizza like a simple cheese pizza and then it has Sarah. The it got beetroot. <laughs> Sarah, no, no. Fucking beetroot. no Do, here's the question do they if that was a thing but no like it has boccaccini on it and it is so good but the one place that makes it does not exist anymore <gasps> and it's... wait what's boccaccini boccaccini is um little balls of cheese White oh, cheese. is that is and it almost it, like um? Is it almost similar to like? Are, are they are they uh, yeah. a burrata? Uh, I don't know what I'm not sure. They're like the I, little okay because I think them before it's like the little mozz almost like the little burrata is like um it's, it's like a it's, it's like, like a ball like a of burrata. mozzarella with cream okay. yes. inside yes it's so like you cut you break into it and it spills like a little bit of cream everywhere yes it's like a burrata but it doesn't have like cream inside like you can bite oh, into okay. it and nothing like spills out mm. um, it's just like a little but... pearl of cheese Jeez. yeah it's um bocconcini <laughs> it's um it's here hang on let me get a photo of it that is mouth yeah, Wait. yeah. So it's oh. like they're tiny enough that they're just like bite sized. Oh, I love um, that. And if you put I them on pizza, and if you and you put them in things and they melt, mm -hmm. and so like it adds that little extra, oh. you know, to it. So I'll wait. I'll add a photo to public grimoire so oh, you dude, guys can please. see. Yeah. My favorite pizza: is tandoori so chicken, ground beef, and barbecue sauce instead of tomato for the base. Ooh. Interesting. Mm -hmm. I think I'd like that just with the barbecue sauce and the tandoori. I'm not it sure about the ground beef. Awesome. I've never been a fan of just putting like uh, a plain um, meat on the chick uh, on the pizza. <laughs> it like, has I, to be like every, spice or It has to be spi somewhere. yeah, like pepperoni or sausage um, or ham. Ham's got like that really Ooh. salty flavor to it. Now I'm kind of thinking. Now. now I'm thinking. I wonder if anyone did like. You know, like Spanish style breakfast sausages? True. It's like, I wonder if they've ever done like that on pizza. I think that would be really good. You should make your own with that. That's the fun part about making pizza at home, too. I found a pizza that has bocconcini on it, melted. <gasps> yes. So you can Please. see what it looks like. Thank you. Ooh! It Those makes look it like, like such good, creamy. Oh, yes, that's the kind of cheese ah, you want to get for your margarite mm -hmm. pizza. Yes. Mm -hmm. That looks so good. And then imagine that with like a thin slice of chicken. That does sound good. Mm -hmm. It's very good. Very good. Mwah! My favorite pizza yeah, order is like... personal pan, extra cheese plus pepperoni. Because I don't like my pizza to be too heavy or to have mm. like too um much because i just get i kind of two things that are a bit too rich mm -hmm. um and also allergies and stuff and like other things right. so, like this was like, perfect it was like because i love chicken too so the whole thing was just oh good so good mm -hmm. that sounds lovely mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. okay do we want to yes. get started yes um yes let's get started. Let can i be me... the judge <laughs> yes. <laughs> Considering that I will not be speaking to Mackle here, so <laughs> yeah, it's kind you, of can, you can steal the judge and um, yes, and Bobby if he shows up. I can't remember uh, if yes. he's gonna show up again. <gasps> be um, my partner. <laughs> I, wish, 
<laughs> Let's. I, um, I want to take a. I want to take a quick break, really quick, just because. Um, I uh, I want to eat just a little bit more of. I got some more spicy chicken. <laughs> nice. nice. Um, and I want to eat a little bit more of that before we start proper, and uh, I'll force Twitch to get the ad break out of the way. So. <laughs> okay. All right, so <laughs> have a ears. raffle. We'll be back in like literally three minutes. Um, and yeah, see you guys in a second.
All right. <clears throat> I am back. After scarfing Hello. down so much delicious chicken, I could eat that shit all day. <laughs> oh my god. Um. <laughs> let me shut off this music. Oh wow, I'm just going for it. <laughs> I yep. see this man. Just going. Just going just and going, going and going. Let me turn the sound back on. Okay, there we go. I remember we have the his voice. I important his voice. Foley work of <laughs> the, the page turning. What is fucking thumb too? It just keeps going, huh? Yeah. yeah, yeah. It's been he working since last it. week. He He's been here thumb. this whole time. <laughs> um, I forgot. I felt like I was going to say something, but I forgot. Whatever. I already said I want nothing to do with this trial. What a great like line to start on. You fucking yeah. bad bitch. <laughs> <laughs> why, Becca? You're not Blackwell. Why did you read his line? <laughs> you fucking bad bitch. <laughs> How juvenile. It is not a matter of what you want, for you will cooperate, Hugh O'Connor. Peter Blackwood. I, I'm, yes, I'm here. Um, Sorry. I will not sound like Mac. That's fine. Prosecutor okay. Blackwell, why have you called this witness? I think you kind of sound oh. like Mac. You're doing the same kind of. Yeah, voice. you're yeah. doing the you're same doing tone. Same I yeah, always, I always yeah. fear that I make him sound patronizing or sarcastic when I do. No. <laughs> no, you don't. Yeah, you sound great. Yeah, you sound great, Thanks. man. Mm -hmm. We are all love fun. Yeah, we are all love. Yeah. Him. What a coincidence! I'm all love you too. Uh. <laughs> you will recall that the day before the mock trial. In short, the day of the murder, the accused testified that she left for home at around 6 p.m. Yes, my notes here do confirm that fact. Right, our client wasn't at school at, at the estimated time of death, so she couldn't be- Objection! Yet, that was but a felicitous, felicitous lie, or am I mistaken? Golden boy. Uh, he's clearly blue. <laughs> I'm blue. Your formation. And da ba dee ba ba da. Da ba dee da ba da. Da ba dee da ba da. Clarinet in there, actually, in the thing that's. It's, it's a the huge stuff. clarinet. It's like a contra-based <laughs> clarinet. <laughs> Not the bass clarinet. He he would. He's the type of nerd who would. <laughs> I have no intention of saying anything more. Now, if you'll excuse me. Hold! I am not through with you yet. <laughs> it seems the rogue prosecutor has it out for me. I believe. And we just might discuss you know what. Excuse me, what? Hello? <laughs> no, wait. <laughs> One little statement and Mr. Cool loses it? What's that all about? What kind of dirt did Blackwell get? <laughs> I changed my mind. Oh god, he's sweating. I'll stay and I'll testify. Hmm. Are you sure, Mr. O'Connor? <laughs> the world of the word of a genius is as good as gold. Let's get on with this. Hugh O'Connor, senior at Themis Legal Academy, lawyer course. How's that? Just fine. Your testimony, then, uh, I I if you please. You're up against the top of the class now. I'd be careful if I were you. I know Junie would never lie like that. That pompous schoolboy won't know what hit him. He sure won't. We're gonna hit him with the fist of justice. I'm going to punch him in the fucking face. I'm gonna hold him while you do that. <laughs> Can I please take off my glasses first? No. No, you may not. I'm gonna hit you with your glasses. Ow. <laughs> 
My get mentally Ms. prepared. Ms. Sykes. <laughs> <laughs> we have violent urges yeah, that we need to express. <laughs> violent now. <laughs> so I would just be like, yes. Good. <laughs> Good. <laughs> My pupils. <laughs> the, the cinematographer just like, the, what's it called? The, the, the stenographer. Stenographer. The stenographer is just like typing like, the, the, the defense and the, oppo uh, and the prosecution begin to beat up the witness. <laughs> <laughs> In tandem? <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> get mentally prepared for the mock trial, I meditated at the archery range till 7 p.m. At around 7.15, I went to the main building before going home. That's when I saw Juniper. We didn't say much as we passed by each other. She seemed her usual self. That's it. Anything else you'd like to ask? Yes, how did you get that gleam on your glasses? <laughs> oh, it's the lighting. I always make sure to catch it. Amazing. That... that is quite enough. Well done, golden boy. <laughs> the final bell rings at 7pm, at which point the campus is a desolate place. Now, you will recall the tape recorder. We know the time of the voice recording. It was 7.10pm, the day before the mock trial. That was the dark hour of this heinous crime. Do you have any proof of that? As its final bell, the school plays a special broadcast when the clock strikes 7. The female voice on the tape appears 10 minutes after that broadcast. I mean, but how do you know that? Can I finish my explanation? <laughs> no, you may not. I want to know now. Well, I'm gonna <laughs> do it anyway. Fuck you. <laughs> the killer waited until the school was empty to spring her devious and deadly trap. Yeah, when the clock strikes seven, David Lich comes on the announcement. No! And what does he say? What does no, he say? He does it. No! <laughs> yes, he does. David Lynch, friend of the stream, comes on the school announcement. When did he become friend of the stream? Oh, uh, today. <laughs> I, I, sorry, excuse me. Um, he he's always been. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> uh -huh. This was official today. Yeah. <laughs> Just watch somehow this gets back to David Lynch. Oh, God, if it did, I wouldn't know what to do. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Mr. Lynch! <laughs> I'm groveling on my knees. Oh, Lord. Yep. Especially on Friday. <laughs> it's a fucking Friday once again! Oh. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, I need everyone to know that David Lynch um, posts a video to YouTube every single day of the week in the morning okay. uh, to tell you what day it is and what the weather is going to be like in LA and what song he was thinking about recently. Wonderful. And it's very charming, and I love him <laughs> for it. <laughs> mm hmm, mm hmm. Okay, sorry. No, we can't. Excuse me, Simon. We had a very important dance break to take. Um, and actually, I'm not sorry at all. You can you can wait for David Lynch, friend of the stream. <laughs> oh, he's my yes. friend. I should also start uploading videos of myself. Judge, so. I would love I would love nothing more than to see you every day. <laughs> Tell us what day it was. Everything you do, but your honor. Haka is a fan of David Lynch. He even really enjoys Twin Peaks. But you don't? Well, I don't really get to watch it that much in prison. How does Saka get to watch it? <laughs> he doesn't live in prison. He can go out. <laughs> I have I have Fulbright take him home and he watches it on Netflix. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. Um, okay, well I guess so I guess when you when get out we should show you that, huh? <laughs> Well, I'm on death row, so 
Oh. That's not going to be happening. Did we know that yet? <laughs> yes, we did. It was announced. Wait, 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 what was it announced? <laughs> I thought it was announced, like, in his introduction, like, animation thing. I don't think it was. Oh, Bobby did. Okay, Bob. Yeah. I was going to say. Uh, so... Anyway, uh, judge. Watching over that, uh, <laughs> witness. So the defendant, that would have been. Indeed, it was five minutes after the voice was captured on tape in the art room. Ergo, we know that the accused was still in the main building even after the killing. I'm making him sound too posh. Hmm. So the time of the murder and the time of when the body was moved. Great, another inconvenient testimony. Miss Sykes, your cross examination, please. Okay, right, hold up. Yeah. What is the explanation for how we know that this recording took place at seven ten? Oh, because so they said that the school the school system has like a an automated uh message that comes on at 7 p.m. um that says the same thing every day that's like you know one of those like the school is now mm. closed see you tomorrow or recording. whatever so then the, in the in the recording the recording was captured that message right cuz it's just going all mm -hmm. the time okay. in that room okay. it captured that message and then if they look at the timestamp in the recording if they scroll forward like 10 more minutes then they hear the voice screaming. So that's gotcha, that's okay. why they're like, the murder took place at 7.10. I see. Okay. I missed I missed the part where the recording was going all the time. Oh, yeah. It's it's a recording that is going 24-7. So. Okay. Um, meditated till 7. 7.15. I went to the main building and saw Juniper didn't say much and that's it what what evidence do we have again the didn't say much thing is is um pinging ping, pinging off some alarm bells for me yeah yeah I mean, wait I okay about that report yesterday yeah, meet with you about that report. Yeah, okay, that's because the twenty third. That was the night that we're in question. Yeah, yes. and also, why would she have been out there at that time? Yeah, why did Junie lie well, they, about going home? They had the six? picture. They had the picture. Oh wait, did Junie say that she went she went home at six? Like definitely. That's why. That's what Athena said. That she was okay. like, no, yeah, J Junie said that she left at six, so everything's fine. And she's like uh, believing that Junie told the truth. So okay. I'm. I think it was probably when they went to see Juniper mm -hmm. at the what call call it. Depend. De 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 mm. Detention center. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I guess my question is. Um, I'm just going to I'm just going to press all of these really quick. I don't know if this is one of those situations where we need to do that. I think it is. <laughs> so um you meditate often? <laughs> <laughs> you come here often? <laughs> yeah, that's what I was going for. <laughs> don't t don't tell me you're going to start pestering me. Too. I mean, that's literally my job, so <laughs> what's that supposed to mean? <laughs> No need to play dumb with me. Oh, I'm not playing. Oh my oh, god. Oh no. I hate Ew, that. Dude. Bro, you're, you're barking up the wrong tree. You. You're I cool. Again, with the <laughs> the undeserved confidence. <laughs> let yeah. me hit on the pr let me hit on the defense. In the middle of the trial, when I'm on the witness stand, <laughs> like what? At least act like I'm the one being hit on. Oh uh, yeah. The trial. Uh, well, th yeah. I think that's the that's the yeah. It's like God, the, the arrogance. The arrogance. This man can choke. <laughs> all all the girls want to know about my private life. 
<laughs> oh my god! <laughs> sure. Oh, sorry. into the defense, this is a court of law, not a pickup spot. <laughs> Why is Athena getting in trouble? Me? <laughs> it's this blatant sexism here. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> Black will. But Simon's just going with it because it's useful to him. Like, he hey Simon, can I borrow your attack hawk? <laughs> I mean, do you want me to just use Taka? I can do it. Uh, I mean, it's more satisfying if I do it. <laughs> Don't think Taka would listen to you, but okay. There you go. Taka, go over to Miss Sykes. <laughs> Taka, attack! Taka, I do <laughs> Get it? Taka, 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 that bitch. <laughs> Objection! <laughs> objection! 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 I I'm just trying to establish the witnesses. If you must know, I never go a day without meditating. Satisfy now, stalker girl. Athena, the, I'm the, so sorry. Literally, literally, if Apollo was doing the fucking cross examination right now, this would not be happening. Right? <laughs> what the fuck? No. What the fuck? <laughs> I'm so mad right now. Like, I feel for her so much. This, oh. <laughs> See, you better take that. Whoa, whoa there, Tiger. Just take a deep breath and relax. Everyone else, you're all bitches and I hate you. <laughs> you're a bitch too. Lay, lay off my little sister. <laughs> Say, wait, excuse me, my little brother. I forgot we made this <laughs> <Yeah>. distinction. <laughs> <laughs> huh. I'll just continue my testimony now. If you don't mind. Oh, I mind a lot, but go on, bitch. Tell us how it wasn't you. I know it was. Fuck you. <laughs> oh, I guess we'll press this. Ow. <laughs> Our client has stated that she went home at 6 o'clock p.m. Oh, okay. We are getting this refresher. Are we going to do the voices thing? Uh, we... Oh, you. we always... Uh, listen. We, we, we do it. We don't always do it, is the no, thing. No, no, it's always that's, a, that's true. A, it depends. We do it when we you remember. So you remembered, so just go for it. <laughs> okay. You and Professor Court were busy preparing for the mock trial together yesterday, right? Was that the last time you saw her? Yes. I went to school at around 6 p.m. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you got <laughs> Fuck <laughs> me! <laughs> She sounds like a mouse! Yeah. <laughs> Red, that was so good! That was so good! I think so. <laughs> no. Ron. <laughs> I don't know what she was doing, but Juniper was definitely at school after 7 p.m. Clavier, like, bitch, have some class. Apollo, you flirted <laughs> with me constantly. Clavier, classily. <laughs> it's so classy. I made sure to do it in the point where the stenographer was, like, shitting me on instead. Apollo got to meet his prosecutor with the damn, you're staring at me so much it's making me feel things. <laughs> Remember all those times that Apollo was like, wow, Clavier's, like, so cool. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> and every time it just read as a gay crisis. <laughs> uh, but I suppose neither side can prove one way or the other. Okay. No? <laughs> but if Juni was there, that means she's lying. Or they both Truth are lying. That's true. Truth be told, I only saw her for the briefest of moments. So you just walked past a good friend, barely saying a word? The final bell had already rung. I get mad when you stand around chatting. Then again, we're not like you people. <laughs> talking endlessly in those annoyingly loud voices. Okay, Connor I think is 100% straight <laughs> and is definitely like <laughs> homophobic yeah. dogging right now. 
Yeah, like I was yes. like before. No, like you people. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> the fucking Just... gaze. <laughs> He unfortunately, like, so far, I can't read him as anything but straight. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Annoyingly loud voices? I'd like- <laughs> I'd like it if you refrain from insulting my partner like that. Oh, this is a very interesting Apollo side profile. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> I really like it, but I don't know- I don't know what's going on here. <laughs> Normally, I'd shout objection right about now, but I'll take this one for the team. <laughs> anyway, I think that's about all I have to say. Connor is bringing Zoomer says gays don't need pride parade anymore energy. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> what I, what I, are I, they I even I just realized what? I gave I'm giving him the voice. I'm trying to give him the same tone that my cousin in the Marines talks like. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> I'm it's like, working. I'm getting that voice. <laughs> oh lord. Uh, so many things. So many things I don't have quite answers for. <laughs> All right, I'll take you up on your kind offer. I expect as much. So, go ahead. Ask away. Um. Mr. O'Connor, I want to ask you... Why did you stay past the last Well, level? he said he was meditating. Well, but he said he was meditating until 7. It's like, why would he go into the main building and not just leave immediately, right? Mm-hmm. Why would an honor student like you ignore the last bell? I wouldn't say I ignored it. I was simply running a little late. Do you remember exactly how late? <laughs> You're a stickler for details, lady. Okay, so this hinges on details. Genius. Yeah. But if I had to say, it was maybe about 10, 15 minutes. If you think it's that important, I'll add it to my testimony. I was hoping you'd say that. Got him. Got him. Ha Got him. Got him how? Wait, what? Ten minutes. Well, every time that we have to add something to the testimony, <laughs> that's the thing that we get, that we get them. We, we've been here. We've been, we we've been here before. <laughs> I, I mean, this is I true. I think I've seen this show before, and I did like the ending. <laughs> <laughs> yes! Yes! <laughs> <laughs> you ignored the last bell for no reason? Shame on you! <laughs> no, shame on you. Pressing me for no reason. You- I have a reason. I love well. that animation of hers, though, where she, like, she yeah. steps out Gosh. of the objection and, like, puts her hands on her hips and is like, <laughs> Yeah. That's Fuck good. you. It's good. Again with this Apollo face, what is he doing? <laughs> <laughs> he looks so. He, he looks very melancholy or like yeah. bittersweet for no he reason. Like he's zoning out, you know. Yeah, like he's, he's like star he's staring at the floor and being like, "Man, God, I wish I was man. literally anywhere else." Yeah, man, I'm thinking about them titties. We had last night. Which? <laughs> 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 what? Their Clavier's titties, obviously. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Clavier's titties. Yeah, they're just not in view right now, though, so I'm like, wow. That's why he's staring them, at the floor like, imagining them. Where else are you going <laughs> to stare and imagine them? True. I could be spending time with my boyfriend instead of this. <laughs> <laughs> at which point, DJ would ask you which boyfriend. <laughs> uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> wait, he has more than one boyfriend now? He mentioned earlier, remember, like, he uh... He has a bestie. He has a childhood oh, yeah, friend. He has a childhood uh, uh, friend. Uh, <laughs> I had to step up my game, so I sent him a Snapchat since he made loves this case. <laughs> he's like, he's like, oh, I wish I could pull my phone out again. <laughs> oh, Sarah! Sarah, you object to this? Wow. Hold on, hold, please. Hold, hold, hold. Objection! I <laughs> <laughs> what? Why did it have to be the Mo Mos Karma one? <laughs> I 
don't know who this bestie is. I'm missing for the right. But he's only he's only mentioned the bestie in name. He hasn't said anything. I else. know he has. I know. Um. So I got no idea. I got, I know his Phoenix no era. This is Apollo's Phoenix era. <laughs> oh yeah, sorry. Yeah, he, just, yeah. he, just he did not. Him, like, yeah, he was like my my childhood <laughs> best friend and I always say this. Blah blah blah. <laughs> uh, God, if he says something in front of Clavier, Clavier is like, oh, th that's so nice, and he's like fuming. I, I jokingly say boyfriend. I think that's like a that's like a a very one sided like Apollo's got Clavier now, one hundred percent. Um. Yeah. But I, I think it's one of those situations where, like, uh, Apollo's funny. SO or anyone else around Apollo would be like, wow, you sure spend a lot of time with that, like, childhood best friend in a way that is, like, maybe not as platonic as you think it is. And he's like, what? No. <laughs> yeah, We're best it's like, on this side, he doesn't realize. <laughs> yeah, it's like one of those things for outside looking in. It's like, you guys are, like, way closer than I thought you were. Oh. <laughs> um... Ugh, anyway, well, some people do run late sometimes, like you on the day this whole case began. <laughs> sorry, not sorry. Boy, it appears we sorry. have a culprit in the case of the pot calling the kettle black. <laughs> <laughs> it too, bitch, your honor. <laughs> it too, it too. That's right. Uh, now what? Ask another question? This popcorn's real good. Yeah, how how was he prepping? Please tell the court what you were doing on October 23rd, the day before the mock trial. Huh, that's an e easy one. Nothing in particular. <laughs> Nothing at all? You didn't help with the preparations? <laughs> I did fuck all. <laughs> <laughs> you don't get it, do you? I was merely playing a role assigned to me. I left the preparations and the light to others. My job was to be mentally prepared. God! Chuni put her heart and soul into getting things ready while he just sat on his behind? <laughs> just to reiterate, I spent most of the 23rd meditating at the archery range. What? I'm just imagining him like an NPC. He is an NPC, but an NPC just like <laughs> not even rendering until someone approaches him. Yeah. He just he just t posed the entire day <laughs> in the archery room. That Wonderful. yeah. When someone walked in, he rendered and like spawned into the world in a meditative pose. <laughs> but as soon as they closed that door, he was in a t pose again. So this is why he says this shit, because he doesn't remember what he does. He yeah. just, he, he's meditation. He thinks he's meditating. No, he's just in the cyberspace. He's just despawned. <laughs> <laughs> he's gone back to the asset catalog. Oh, gosh. <laughs> oh, gosh. I didn't talk to anyone until the school closed at 7 p.m. When I rested. <laughs> I suppose a few archery club members did come and go while I was there. But you didn't talk to anyone? Not a single soul? <laughs> That's right. I didn't say a word to anyone till the final bell at 7pm. I see. This is crucial information. Please had to see your testimony. <laughs> I took a sippy. <laughs> I don't know if you're bluffing, but if you are, you have a pretty good poker face. Gee, thanks. I want to summon mudcrabs to the courtroom so bad. <laughs> I take it the zippy. <laughs> I take it the zippy. I take it. I take it the zippy. No, I, I know I can't drink. I'll drink it. Let me, let me take a sip. I take the zippy. <laughs> Oh no, we're gonna no. kill someone. This is lethal. Please, please don't. I, I don't okay. want to Okay, to okay, okay, I'm stopped. I've stopped. I've stopped. Okay, okay. Okay, everything's good. Cool. Kids also. The sippy <laughs> has been taken. The sippy has been taken. I took a sippy. <laughs> <laughs> hey, bitch, you were supposed to meet with the professor. Yeah, objection. 
So you didn't talk to any anybody on October twenty third. Are you sure about that? Are you sure about that? I already told you I am sure about that. My word is as good as gold. Interesting. Okay, gold then how do you explain this? And don't oh, stare at any of you. How do you explain this? <laughs> Oh, how do how, you explain this? How do you explain this how? How do you explain this? Sorry. How are they do it? Never seen that before. <laughs> this is the victim's planner. She recorded all of her plans in great detail. Take a look at this page here! It reads, 23rd, meet with you, and important. Don't you find that interesting? <laughs> what? what? Where'd you get that? The keyword here is important. You say you were at the archery range all day. But you also said a few students came and went while you were there. That doesn't sound like a great place for an important talk. The entire campus was buzzing with activity before the mock trial. Where could they have possibly had a private conversation? I thought about that too, but the situation changes after the last bell. What's this now? Ow. The witness stayed after the last bell. In order to have a private talk with the victim, am I right, Mr. O'Connor? <laughs> this is insane! Objection. Huh. Must we go through this yet again? I suppose you also have new evidence, as I, usual. I just pres No, I don't have any direct evidence except the fucking planner that, <laughs> <laughs> that, that directly states the plan. Substantial evidence. Sure. Uh, however, the witness was meditating until after the last bell. And he attempted to conceal his private meeting with the victim. Ooh. Uh oh. <clears throat> There's Robin, now me. What are you going- who are you going to accuse next? The milkman! Your mom! <laughs> just another- you take that fucking back. You Your mom, who is the milkman? This attorney <laughs> looking to get ahead. Don't let him get to you, he's definitely hiding something. I mean, he like was supposed mom. to- yeah, He's hiding oh. his mom in this courtroom. That's what's in that big wrapped up purple thing. Uh oh. The kids. Oh, I don't like this lore. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, yeah, no, I've opened, I've opened lore. Pandora's box. Let's rewind that. <laughs> I mean, he was supposed to meet with the victim around her estimated time of death. You're the one whose mom's being hidden, Apollo. <laughs> I had my. Don't you bring that up, Deej. <laughs> what is this? What is this artwork? <laughs> <laughs> Robin looking like hehehehehe. <laughs> 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 <He's>, uh, <laughs> really, <laughs> not my thing about is that I per like Athena had suspicions about Robin. I never uh -huh. did. <laughs> I, I never did. <laughs> yeah. Well, I mean, I think at this point Athena is just trying to prove that, like. Somebody else I, I, like Juni was not the only person who could have done it, right? Yeah. yeah. So she's like, okay, well, Robin and uh, and Hugh also had ample opportunity. Uh, if he's lying, why is it in Apollo's bracelet going up? I think that's what Apollo is also trying to say. I know generally he says like my bracelet confirms it or whatever. <laughs> um, but uh, I like to imagine. Um, Oh! <laughs> <laughs> what I want, the I want both of them standing next to each other looking equally, like, <laughs> evil. Hugh <laughs> seems just as guilty. These three are the only possible suspects, after all. Mr. O'Connor, answer me this. Did you meet with Professor Court that day? <laughs> Sorry, Mr. Jailbird Prosecutor. I don't mean to steal your thunder, but I have something to say. Oh? It 
will save me some trouble, then by all means, speak away. If you would recall, Miss Sykes, the voice on the tape recorder was female. Maybe you did an impersonation. Knowing yeah. that, I'd like you to explain how I could possibly be a suspect. Uh I would like to just state that just because we have someone saying you're a goner doesn't mean that the fucking yeah. killer said that, you know? This also seems very circumstantial, you know? Yeah, this entire case it. is like a the goddamn thing. Yeah, it's uh -huh. like the fact that we're using it as like... I mean, I, admittedly it was in the art room or whatever, and so mm -hmm. I get it, but like, still, <laughs> I'm, I'm just saying that we're like... We're like using this as if it's like, uh, f yeah. what, what do they call it? That um, con only. concrete evidence, you know, yeah. that yeah. that the killer is feminine or in some. Yeah, they're like, <laughs> this is our decisive <laughs> evidence when we can't oh even my. get a voice finger, like a voice print, on who it is. And it's like, yeah, they bruh, insist you, Connor, you, they you insist even is your preferred name. Yeah, they are basing <laughs> off everything that, you know, like, they're basing everything off that one piece of evidence that they haven't even confirmed as concrete. Uh, yeah. Uh, Hi, Sam. <laughs> Hi, Sam. Hi, Sam. Riddle me, sis. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. Anyway. Oh, he has a point, except he doesn't. He doesn't, though. <laughs> Impressive. Golden Boy here does shine gold indeed. This is sarcasm. <laughs> Care to take the reins? You're more than capable of prosecuting this case. Oh god, he just left! <laughs> <coughs> Sorry, I that was a but glitch. I'm studying to be a lawyer. What a pity. I think such genius is to be wasted on mere lawyering. Um. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> At last! Your moment is here, Sykes Dono. Time to refute Golden Boy's statement. And prove that you're the young prodigy worthy of the badge of your on your lapel. Could he lay on any more pressure? The voice is unmistakably female, except not really, so I <laughs> but I guess there's no point in arguing about that because no one will listen to us. <laughs> yeah, you're right. In which case... <laughs> to whom does the voice on the tape recorder really belong to? I feel like that uh, belonged to the victim. Yeah. Yeah. I'm a uh, high key, I'm still rooting for it being Scuttlebutt. Um, <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> fourth yeah, option, yeah. it's I Scuttlebutt. Can her, I can see her saying that if like she's get gained a scoop or something. Oh. Like, she's gained what she thinks is, like, really good evidence to, uh, like, get like, somebody. You're a so goner! Like, you're a goner! Mm-hmm. I'm oh, sorry, that's me. <laughs> Her <laughs> voice on the tape belongs to the victim. That's the only thing that makes sense. Objection. Are you mad? The voice on the recording says, you're a goner. Yeah, and Okay, and are we even, are we even sure that that's what she said, though? Yeah. Again! That is- Yeah, again. There's something- That is something a murderer shouts at their victim, not the other way around. Do you have... experience? We <laughs> <laughs> <You> are not. <laughs> Listen, Simon look at... just, like, levels. Athena! <laughs> Athena! <laughs> Apollo puts his hand on her shoulder. Athena! <laughs> Well, so we're gonna get to that, but like, let's drop this that, for now. That's at least two cases away right now. We're not gonna something talk about like that. that. Yeah. yeah, something like that. <laughs> so the image of Simon shouting, "You're a goner!" before killing. Fuck. <laughs> 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 Oh no. <sighs> <sighs> Alright, uh, hmm. Yeah, that is a problem, I guess. You're a goner. You're a goner. You're a goner. 
Um, no, Connor. Uh, oh my Athena. god. <laughs> <laughs> Becca gets it. Becca gets it. A whole minute. You got it. A you whole it. minute before. <laughs> You embodied Athena yes. like so hard. <laughs> Beck, I can't believe this. Becker really is Athena. Whoa, Athena, you're really scaring me here. <laughs> you're scared. I'm terrified for even coming up with this. With what? <laughs> Prosecutor Blackwell, you wanted to know if I am worthy of my badge. Girl, you don't need to prove yourself to him. Too late, I'm already doing it. <laughs> well, I'm about to show you why, despite my age, I'm able to proudly wear this at all. Oh? Then can I take you won't be changing your argument? Still, it stands that it's a bit odd for the victim to be the one yelling, You're a goner. I agree. If that's what the victim was saying. But it's not. Hmm. I assume you have something to back up your assertion, Miss Sykes? Even better, the image of Southern Blackwell saying, <laughs> You're a goner. <laughs> Before <laughs> killing someone. Do you mean the song by 21 Pilots? <laughs> you need your last haul. You need your last haul. <laughs> Bug. Not exactly, but you don't have to add fuel to his fire, but your honor. If it is indeed Professor Kor's voice on the tape, then she was shouting because she was... She was scolding him. She was like, Hugh O'Connor! <laughs> I would like to call one basic fact into question. Is that shout on the tape really saying, you're a goner? What are you up to now, Athena? Professor Court's planner says she was supposed to meet with the vi witness for an important talk. Perhaps our witness, despite being a genius, had done something wrong. And this made Professor Court get angry with him during their private meeting. I don't see how this changes what we heard on the tape. Well, if you want to see how it changes things, then let's try a little experiment. Bitch, Your Honor, I want you to yell at the witness as if you're mad at him. But, and this is important, use his full name. Uh, okay. <laughs> Let's see. Um, Hugh O'Connor. Huh. <laughs> what did I do to deserve that? By being a bitch. Ow. <laughs> <laughs> yes, like, like that. Now try again, but faster. Yeah, uh, Hugh O'Connor. You are Connor. You a Connor? Connor? You a Connor? You a Connor? Wait a second! No, 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 this can't be. Objection! You think I'd spend this energy to lead you this far if it wasn't true? Ah, but it is, bitch, Your Honor. Humors are not perfect. That's scientific fact. We sometimes mistake shadows for monsters, or the wind for voices. I just got flashbacks to Emma Sky. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Remember baby Emma, and she would always be like, and the Oh wait, no, I'm thinking I'm I'm getting wires crossed. I was thinking about um over the garden wall and how Greg is always like, and that's a rock fact. Um, and then I was thinking, wouldn't it be that's cute a rock fact. if Emma Sky was always like, that's a science fact. I remember she, say, she was always like, scientifically speaking. Yeah. And she still says it, like, scientifically speaking. She does still say it. It's less cute now because she's a jaded adult, but. Uh, yeah. Like, <laughs> but, uh, the difference I... in cadence is between Becca playing baby Emma and me playing adult Emma. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, and that also reminds me when uh, Press Buttons and Talk did their uh, playthrough of the original trip. Yeah, <laughs> Scientifically. Be like, Scientifically speaking. God, it was, was so cute. <laughs> I was tempted to do that back when I was playing Emma, but I didn't want to feel I didn't yeah, want people to it's be like, like 
<laughs> You're <laughs> copying. Chris <laughs> <laughs> and It was so cute. cute. Like, I Very remember cute. that all the time. I, I look forward to listening or watching Press Buttons and Talks playthrough of Ace Attorney once we get through all of this and kind of see which bits we pick up compared to Oh, I <laughs> oh they done. I don't think they've done this trilogy. Yeah, no, they they, the they, they, they did the first three. Before, but they haven't. They, they did the first the Edgeworth thing. They yeah. did the first three and Edgeworth Investigations. So if you steer yeah. clear of their Edgeworth Investigations one, um, you're totally good. You can go watch them. They're okay. so good. Oh my god. Nice. Um, and then the pandemic hit, and then they never started up again. <laughs> well, I think it's specifically um, who, who was the other guy? It was someone in. Yeah. I don't know his name. I can't remember his name, really but bad. he. Um, <laughs> no, he he got. Um, no, Sungwon made the new channel specifically because Alex uh, got, like, really sick. Um, oh. And was, like, dealing with a bunch of, like, chronic uh, illness, yeah. like, life stuff. And was like, I can't do it anymore. So then Sungwon started a different channel. And has not touched Ace Attorney because it was like... Oh, oh they, they're not yeah. friends anymore? What? Oh. Okay, oh. I had heard that it was because... Oh. Gee, okay, never mind. I'm not touching that then. Okay, never I mind. Thought, I thought the announcement was that um, that Alex just couldn't do it anymore, so. Oops. Yikes! Okay, uh, anyway! Uh... Alas. Hmm, now that you mention it. You can do this, Athena. Just give the old guy one li more little push. Right off that clock tower. <laughs> No! Is that a Kingdom Hearts thing? I don't know. <laughs> I, mean, I was trying to think clock. of a large structure that you could push someone off of. And there's my brain immediately the, supplied the, Clock Tower. There's also the horror game Clock Tower 3. I have never played a Clock Tower game. As opposed to you Clock Tower 1 and 2. Well, I want to. Clock Tower 3 is the one that I remember specifically has an old man antagonist in it. So oh, I see. Why. Okay. I okay. See, I see. The voice on the tape recorder never was your goner. That's only what we thought we heard, when in fact it was the witness getting yelled at. The court will note that this is different from the selective hearing men are so good at. <laughs> <laughs> Do it. Yes. I, I think you're right, but uh, actually, no, I think you're right on all parts. Go off, queen. <laughs> never mind. <laughs> uh, the important thing is that the voice that was recorded isn't our client's. And since it was the victim scolding the witness, he he must now join the list of suspects. <laughs> Objection. Hmm. I had thought that testimony would suffice, but it seems it has come to this. I will not allow such fallacious quibbles to upend this case. The prosecution has one final piece of evidence to present to the court. Evidence? What's he going to pull out now? And why the fuck are you waiting? I <laughs> updated autopsy reports. <laughs> Feast your eyes on this photo, and let me see that insolent look vanish from within them. <laughs> oh, hello! Oh, they're so cute! Aww. <laughs> Oh, it's me. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. You're good. Let's see here. Oh, it's a picture of the defendant and the victim. Photograph. Photographs shows professor and student preparing for the mock trial together. Wait, was this taken in the art room? The room where the murder occurred? Indeed it was. The revelations do not end there. Do you see the clock on the wall? Five past ten. Mm. Mm -hmm. It reads 7.05, a mere <laughs> five minutes before the clock was recorded on the tape. The, the rumor the it happened? happened? <laughs> <laughs> no, no. <laughs> what? what? <laughs> the accused brutally stabbed the victim to death five minutes after this photo was taken. Okay, oh, Sarah, that's from but... Hamilton the Musical. Yeah. 
Okay, okay so hold on a second. Uh, <laughs> they're, they're, oh. You're gonna tell me that they took this really happy photo and then Junie decided five minutes later to be like, actually, you know what? Fuck this bitch. I'm gonna. <laughs> right? Yeah, it doesn't really make much sense. Also, what, okay, so also the. Um, I, w- I can't remember if this was proven with Scuttlebutt's. Um, testimony before but like i remember part of it was that like oh like junie definitely uh killed killed her because they're she was upset that her um uh trial thing wasn't being chosen or whatever uh and so, so like it, why were they working on the mock trial together if her thing was in fact chosen what yeah. Like what, well, no, it's that uh, the edits that Junie had made. Remember, because she was she had rewritten okay. her own thing to yeah. um, favor the prosecution, and then um, Professor Court was like, uh, "No, girl, you're gonna." It was good how it was. We're not making those changes. Um, so that the scuttlebutt and in the prosecution's um, argument was that Junie couldn't stand that she didn't have like complete control over the script. And that was why. I thought I thought the thing was that, um, she, like her her script wasn't chosen at all because like, oh they, scuttlebutt they said... wasn't scuttlebutt was mad. No, that no, her yeah. Had Look at Deej. Deej just saying that they presented scuttlebutt's case was in the envelope that was supposedly the real one, and that was like, oh. the whole thing about it. Oh. Um. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway. <laughs> I'm, I'm, so I'm just that. saying it doesn't it doesn't fucking make sense is what I'm saying. <laughs> by all accounts, it doesn't make by, sense. By all accounts, it doesn't make sense. Yeah, no, it doesn't at all. It just doesn't mm. add up. <laughs> it seems the defendant's culpability in this crime is quite obvious. Junie was with Professor Court just five minutes before she was murdered. There is a lot can happen in five minutes. Mm-hmm. Uh, what now? Nothing I say can change that fact. Huh. Unless the clock was fast or slow or something, you yeah. know? Understand now? According no, to all known don't. laws of aviation, it doesn't add up. <laughs> you can believe in your client. All people. God, they oh, really wish. did not. They <laughs> really. God, this is anything. Rough. This is horrible. We need to go to the local localizers and be like, hey, you done fucked up. <laughs> yeah. All you wish. Try as you might. Such misplaced faith will inevitably be cut down before the cruel, steely blade of truth. <laughs> Listen, Missy. Don't call the me person... Missy. Sykes don't know. <gasps> the person you'd like to save more than anyone else in the world? Willing to wager that your defense isn't what they desire. But, I feel but... like you're projecting, my dude. Yeah, Somehow, just a little I feel bit. It. I feel it. I became a lawyer so I could. You still fail to understand? After so much pain and defeat, the courts are not the play yards of little children dressed as lawyers. Damn, dude. So before you break your back in failure, run along home and grow up. Dude. But I'm dressed Uh... as a canary, so fuck you! (laughs) (laughs) Sylvester and and Tweety Bird. (laughs) Fuck! (laughs) Oh my god, yes. (laughs) Guy has only seen Looney Tunes. Getting a lot of Looney Tunes vibes from this. <laughs> I was so glad. I was like getting so intense with Simon. And I was like, oh yeah. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> if he thinks I'm giving up now, he's got another thing coming. Like my fist. <laughs> <laughs> I have to find my inner strength if I ever, have, if I ever hope to save him. Yeah, uh, but I can't think of any way to strike back. I'm getting slowly smaller. <laughs> the camera's panning out. <laughs> the 
worst of <laughs> the worst of times are when lawyers have to force their biggest smiles. That's impossible. How can I smile under these circumstances, even if I forced it? This is badder than bad. Who knew Blackwell was holding that one and had that one waiting in the wings? Literally in the wings of his bird. It was hiding in there. <laughs> what in that twisted samurai just presented at the beginning? This is just like Mr. Edgeworth's fucking update updated <laughs> round <-topsy> report. <laughs> Wait, maybe this was his real plan? <gasps> Turtle? She's going to eat. Maybe oh, after she's no. eaten, she'll come <laughs> baby by. Baby needs snack. Baby, baby needs snack of cleaner. <laughs> Clean baby's tum tums. <laughs> oh no! Was he just trying to show me how weak and powerless I am? <laughs> maybe he's right because I really haven't gotten clue. Who's the real killer? Who murdered Professor Constance Court? <laughs> Robin Newman? A, a girl who had been forced to live as a guy? Or was it Hugh O'Connor, the honor student who had met with Professor Court? Or was it the <laughs> jaded <laughs> fucking report reporter who was constantly hiding in a box? <laughs> there seems to be- oi. Oh, There seems sorry. to be a little reason to debate the defendant's guilt any longer. The time for a verdict has come. Apparently. Huh? Oh, it's oh. not even me. Oh, Robin! Oh. You're still here! <laughs> no! It's not gonna happen, man! <laughs> oh my god, it's so loud. Fucking yes! <laughs> yes, Robin. God yes. bless. I thought, job, I, I, I don't know why, but I thought we'd seen the last of her. And I'm so Me glad. Oh, I love it. <laughs> What's the meaning of this? You can't interrupt a judge about the hand down. Shut up, bitch! <laughs> Maybe, but false forensics are an N O N O. What? Miss Newman, please explain to yourself. Juniper's not the killer. I am. <laughs> I am. <laughs> <laughs> I know because because I know who the real killer is. You do? You know who the real killer is? <laughs> what is she up to now and why didn't you fucking say this already? Yep, I know because the real killer is M E me. I was making a joke earlier. <laughs> oh god, this is the I am Spartacus situation, isn't it? Uh, uh -huh. <laughs> what? It was me. I did it alone. Just me. Or like, what What was the other one? Like, uh, this happens all the time in media, right? Like, like that. Yeah. No, I'm Peter Parker or whatever. Yeah, yeah. yeah. My name's Peter Parker. <laughs> I, I don't know why I'm thinking that happened in a Spider-Man at some point, but I'm Spider- I'm Spider-Man. I don't get it. Why is she confessing? It's because she's in love with Juniper, obviously. Yeah. Uh <laughs> hmm, Ms. New Ms. Newman was witness near the stage. There's even a related photo of her. The more I think about it, the more suspicious she seems. <laughs> Robin Newman isn't the kind of guy who pins the blame on friends. Just so he can walk free! Get it over with! Declare me guilty already! Yes. War Rider dies. Oh no, Judy! Oh, Judy! Objection! <laughs> Please, wait! Juniper, what are you doing? Thank you for all you've done, Thena. But you have to forgive me. Oh, girl, don't, oh, don't do it. I can't let my friends take the blame any longer. Uni, no. Don't do it. <laughs> don't throw your life away. Hugh and Robin have done nothing wrong. They have absolutely no connection to this case. The real killer is... Is me! <gasps> no! I alone am responsible for the entire crime! Her right, her crying! No! Oh, no. <laughs> it was all me. 
What? what, 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 what? Uh, objection! Junie, you know that's not true! Hurry up and retract your statement! I, I'm afraid it is true. Forgive me, Thingna. Okay, well now we've got a double confession, so... Fair order! Will somebody please explain what's going on here? The power of friendship! <laughs> <sighs> I see right through your cheap ploy. School rules state that a prior conviction terminates one's eligibility to graduate. A guilty verdict here would make whatever dreams one had to go... had go up in a puff of smoke. Oh, I wasn't aware. Even meek little mice will fight when cornered. A pitiful spectacle, I might add. These vermin are trying to protect each other now that they have nowhere else to run. Protect each other? Wait. So was Robin just trying to protect Junie too? Duh. Yeah. I mean, duh. 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 Yeah. <laughs> if so, then the real killer is... Objection! <laughs> or is it? <laughs> huh. This whole thing's a joke. Oh, now it's you's turn. <laughs> what? What? What is wrong with kids these days? <laughs> and Bertles. I know what just crossed your mind, Miss Sykes. Oh, what? What? <laughs> <laughs> Bitch! What? Oh, right. This is on the 3DS, so they have to make full use of the 3D oh, right. properties <laughs> of the 3DS. Yeah, well, this is, this is red. You gotta say it while you have, like, a pen. Oh, yeah. Like, something's in first. your mouth. Yeah, you gotta put a, a pen <laughs> pencil in your mouth. Okay, let me. No, I don't want to put a pen in my mouth. I'm gonna fake it. <laughs> Using. Oh. Fuck. Ah. It has our car. <laughs> 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 right wow, he really is a genius. He even knows what you're thinking. How did he put it away huh. so quickly? Archery. Skill. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I think it's about time I told you the truth. Apollo, why do I have to keep having a reaction to this? Please, I'm trying to nap and think about cuddling my boyfriend and my cat. Not Someone like let me go right home. To the point. <laughs> Obviously, because he's running on the Skyrim engine instead of the Oblivion engine. <laughs> <laughs> it was me. I did it. Wait. What? what? There actually really are ride or die for each they're other. Good, good friends. Yeah. Even if there's like discord person. in their hearts or whatever, they're still like besties. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Friends who murder together stay together. <laughs> <laughs> now both potential subsects are big claiming to be the real killer. Uh, I, I'm so confused right now. You still have doubts. How about I detail my murder plot? It's absolute genius. Oh, he's like, I will brag about this till they Enough put me on the gallows. This, this is a court of law, not the set of some high school drama. I mean, it's a little bit high school drama. I, I see I have no you. choice. I'm afraid I'll have to. Boy! Wait, your it's your baldness. I'm sorry, Prosecutor Blackwell, but I'm in no position to hand down a verdict just yet. I want to see more of this. I want an <laughs> encore. I am hoping that the defense and prosecution can come up with some airtight evidence. That is why I am giving you both the rest of the day to continue investigating this case. And also so I can stock up on my snacks. <laughs> <laughs> Pinch me, I think I'm dreaming. Fine. Do as you wish. That this brings today's proceedings to a close. Court is adjourned. Damn. Tap tapity tap, I'm off to calls. <laughs> <laughs> Need to get some more popcorn. <laughs> oh yes, please save. Oh thank God. Okay. Um, 
<laughs> Let's take a quick break before we resume. <laughs> Good idea. Yeah. And get back to all this. Um Oh, you know what? I realized um before I was not using the legally bald backgrounds. Shame oh. on me. How dare Sam. You. I know. Um, so let me fix that before we actually take a break. Um There we go. All right. Uh, everybody have a raffle uh, while we gone. Oh, my God. Becca beating me to it. Um, <laughs> <laughs> we will see you in like uh, five minutes or so.
Sounds like your dream. Sorry, y'all, I'm back. Thank you so much for waiting. Um, I no needed to eat more of that chicken. <laughs> <laughs> and also make a new drink. And also talk to some guys about some things in some places. Uh -huh. And crack open. Rip it and rip it, baby. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. It's seltzer to put on top of my drink. Beautiful. All right. We all back? We all ready? Yep. We all prepared emotionally, physically, Wait, Ren. mentally. Oh, <gasps> Ren! We need Ren. Ren. We especially need Ren to talk. Help us, Ren Kenobi. You're our only hope. Help us, Ren. Whoever the fuck you are, you're my only hope. <laughs> oh. I can't listen. I can't read the original line anymore. <laughs> yeah. With a straight face, because I just remember that time Carrie Fisher tweeted that. I can't even remember what she <laughs> tweeted it in 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 uh in in reference to, but she she was like running into something that was definitely not Star Wars related that she needed help with. It was like asking the internet for help, and she just tweeted, "Help me, Obi Wan Kenobi. Help me, Obi Wan. No, everyone, whoever the fuck, the you, fuck are. you are." You're my only hoe. <laughs> and I'm like, yeah, you're right. <laughs> yes, Princess Leia. <laughs> oh, shit. Ren is lost in stereo. No, we left her in Ikea. No, <laughs> Ren. Ah. Hopefully she can survive on the meatballs till we get to her. I'm sure she can. Apollo can't. tweets that at Clav when he's drunk and needs a ride. Help me, Clavier, <laughs> whoever the fuck you are. You're my only hoe. At Clavier Gavin. <laughs> Thus prompting many, many a, a response uh, uh, comment from people. Who is this? What? Clavier was in the room. He didn't have to tweet at him. Oh, my God. <laughs> Who was it? Who was it? Who was sharing and talking about the um, uh, Clavier Gavin Gavin spending the entire time at some celeb party, tweeting about how he doesn't want to be at the celeb party and how he <laughs> loves his boyfriend. <laughs> <laughs> 
Sarah shared it. Okay, yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna click um I'm gonna click back. Oh my god. Oh we gotta get trucy action? Trucy action? Bitch! I still love um Apollo's jacket is right there. <laughs> I love the fact that he has the jacket, he just never fucking wears it. <laughs> Yeah, it's great. Should should we? I'm I'm gonna click. Oh no, you're fine, Ren. <laughs> Take your time. You are Gucci. I mean, I'm gonna press it so that maybe we get some background <gasps> Him music. Himba, all good. Himba. Are we going or are we waiting? Let's go until Ren. Let's go until up. we hit uh, Ren or Ren shows back up. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Sorry, boss. I couldn't do it. You know that little bit of advice you gave me? The worst of times are when lawyers have to force their biggest smiles. Is that what I sound like? Yeah. Um, oh. I don't know exactly what you meant. You make me sound like a big oaf. I'm... No comment. Uh... Wow. But... <laughs> but there was... But there was no way I could force a smile in that courtroom today. I'm just glad you remembered that. But now, how about relaxing a little? Re relax? Not gonna happen! Girl, self-care. I mean, that's why I have coffee right now, but... <laughs> do, do Wait, me... do you, Becca, have coffee right now? Yeah! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what kind Isn't of coffee are you like drinking? PM? Uh, yeah! Uh, coffee Coffee doesn't uh, doesn't give me... Doesn't energize me. Okay. I'm drinking it purely because I'm of the so taste. I'm so jealous. True. Oh my nice. god! What kind of coffee did you get? Oh, just some Keurig shit. Um, oh. Nice. Dad couldn't I find um, I couldn't find my usual Keurig stuff, so he just got me some Starbucks brand, and it's okay. Uh, yeah. <laughs> they're generally pretty like good. I mean, it's not as good as like getting actual I Starbucks, get but. I get peace. Yeah, it's it's all right. It's not mm -hmm. it's not my favorite. I make <laughs> pour over coffee. <laughs> <laughs> also, the fact that there is no music playing in this scene is really weird. <laughs> well, Athena's down in the dumps. They can't play. I guess they could have been playing sad music though. I feel like anyway. it'd be so corny. Oh, hold on. <laughs> Let me clean my glasses. Holy shit. You ever look at them and then you're like, Ooh, yeah, you have to look at your glasses. <laughs> you ever look at your glasses? I try not to. I it bothers me too much. I'm like, oh bleh. <laughs> literally. Not literally. I'm JK. I I want to get more frames. Like I like these frames. I want more um exaggerated, dumb, I look like a dad from the 80s uh glasses. <laughs> Hello, 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 sorry. Hello. Welcome back, no you're problem. good. Um good. wait, DJ At was that was that what was that why you sent the selfie? Oh, oh fluffy. Yeah, because it's hot. Humidity. Oh. Did I miss anything? Oh, no, okay. not really. No, you didn't. We uh <laughs> Athena was just like, I couldn't smile in court. Ugh. I just I couldn't relax. Uh, uh, Junie, Junie, she asked me to defend her because she believes in me. I mean, I chose to. I just told her I was defending her, and then she was like, "Okay, yeah, I believe." Of, <laughs> you kind of volunteered yourself there. But I, I felt completely helpless. If it weren't for their confessions, I'd. Oh. <laughs> wow. It just took a bite. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> what you eating? Uh, um, just some raisin toast because it's like really quick to, to Yum. prepare. Yum. Um. Yum. <laughs> Yum. Um, should I do funny voice or not? Do we remember yes. this line? I feel yes, like we're Means himself this. is a funny, yeah. funny voice, so... He himself is funny voice. Yeah, but so... The mystery it... proceeds to the same manner and ends in the same way, Simoctrell. <laughs> Would you not lose everything you've worked so hard to gain? Getting a lot of Moriarty vibes from this guy suddenly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah, he's just like smiling and like, mmm. Well, I'll just be make sh have to make sure that doesn't happen then, won't I? Uh -oh. It's rot. <laughs> <laughs> no, I can't lose it all. I not now. Phoenix, what? Phoenix, when Athena Ooh. asked him for help defending her childhood best friend, who's also in the lock room, and it's very different from how she remembers said best friend as a child, this brings up absolutely no memories for me. Phoenix. This, this is none. Shh. <laughs> Hush. You okay, Athena? You're turning kind no. of pale. I can't just stand around here. I'm going to finish the investigation. <gasps> Can, can it wait? I just tricked <laughs> No! 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 Why? No! No! You see a person just immediately mentions her magic candy. I just. <laughs> why do they keep doing this to her? Why? <laughs> It's like when a little it's like when a little kid keeps saying something like highly inappropriate and uncomfortable um realizing it gets a, a like a, a reaction out of adults but yeah. doesn't know why and you're just like oh my please and then they keep saying it yeah, yeah. <laughs> I feel like that's her <laughs> except she's 15 16 now yeah 16 oh yeah. my god Oh, okay. C can it wait? I just took a batch of freshly baked cookies out of my magic panties. Oh my, you actually said it, huh? <laughs> I did, I did say it. <laughs> Thanks, but I'd better get going. <laughs> Don't say for when I get back. Apollo, you wait here. I need to see Junie in the te at the detention center first, right away. Why can't I come with you? No way, no oh, way. You are yeah, excuse me. Are we really going solo on this one? You are the <laughs> sacrificial lamb to eat the cookies. No, that's, <laughs> that's a no way, Athena. I'm coming with you. Back. I'm co I'm going with you, Athena. <laughs> Sorry, Mr. Wright, and also <laughs> Trucy, but I have to go too. <laughs> no problem, you two be careful. I'll Trucy, have the we need to have a talk. My favorite. <laughs> Trucy, <laughs> you can't just keep offering people cookies. <laughs> Phoenix is from like, your wait, no, take me with you. <laughs> <laughs> no, um, Phoenix is like the, the, the science slump of, I have to do some parenting now. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I have to explain to my daughter how she's making everyone wildly uncomfortable. <laughs> <laughs> she needs to stop. Uh, Phoenix is like, this has gone on far too, far too long. Yeah, I'm putting my goddamn <laughs> foot down. It's time. <laughs> Will that stop her? No. Mm -mm. No. Oh. Trucy is an immovable object. Yeah. As well as an unstoppable force. <laughs> <laughs> He's a rare kind. <laughs> that's, that's what makes that's what makes her a grammary. <laughs> yes, and yep. a right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The unstoppable. Which which came from which? I wonder. <laughs> um. Uh. <laughs> that's a good question. I feel like the immovable force. Uh, sorry, the uh, unstoppable force is the grammaries, mm -hmm. and the immovable object is the right <laughs> yeah, side. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> That's what I was thinking. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. Uh, there's so much I need to ask Junie. Like, why the fuck did you lie to me? <laughs> uh, what happened in court today? Where we go from here? What, what are we? we? Are? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I took another bite. Welcome, Adam. <laughs> you, Hang you on. Okay. Hey, um. No, I'm just gonna take a cup of water. Uh huh. Okay. Uh huh. Taking a sippy. I'm sippy. taking a sippy. I'm taking, I'm taking, everybody take a sippy. Take a sippy. Wait, wait, no. no. I'm officially going to change the, the hydration uh, <laughs> channel points. <laughs> take a sippy. <laughs> take a sippy. Yes. Take a sippy. <laughs> yeah, Adam, you're no. just in time. You just missed Hi, an atrocious Adam. line about yeah, the fucking no, magic you panties. You take the sippy. Well, we did take in the sippy. Fancy meeting you here. Are you taking a sippy here too, Professor Means? Don't you see how dehydrated I am? 
<laughs> oh yes. Yeah, yeah maybe you should take a the sippy. Yeah, maybe you should sit down and have a glass of water and then you'll calm down. She has an no, actual conversation bit? Y'all, we gotta I go have... back and talk to Trucy. I have become concrete. I thought you already were. Yes, ages ago. I, I didn't say that. that. Oh, Professor Means, what brings you here? I asked him to come. He arrived just a little before you. Junie, don't tell us you're refusing our defense now. Because uh, I literally won't accept it. I, I wanted to ask him something, but first, Athena, I want to apologize for my sudden confession after you worked so hard to defend me. She was calling me Athena until just now. Oof! This is no, a guy, <laughs> guy who has only seen Mona Zushi. <laughs> Getting a lot of... <laughs> Getting a lot of Weiying vibes from this. Weiying! <laughs> uh, I don't know who that is. <laughs> Give me, it's giving La Wangji! Weiying! La Wangji! <laughs> uh, uh, I don't know who Wait, that is. Sorry, Becca, you don't. Yeah, Becca, you okay. don't. And that's your loss? <laughs> Oh, it's fine. Everything's fine. <laughs> no, I should be the one apologizing. The whole thing spiraled out of my control. I... Don't worry. The Jerry's, oh, really... got... the, Jerry's... <laughs> the Jerry's got me some lunch, so I'm... Um... <laughs> Don't worry. Oh, that's me. on my line. <laughs> Don't worry. I'll really bring it tomorrow. I'll find something to prove your innocence. About that... Athena. Girl, d oh, don't do it. Oh. I've been thinking of asking Professor Means to defend me. Oh my god. Huh? <laughs> Myself only just heard of this a moment ago. Oh, so she thinks Professor Means would be... No, I can't let this happen. Not with the way he wants to do things. Ginny. No, I know, Athena. But will you please hear me out? No, I won't. I refuse. Well, that's not very nice. Why change I... lawyer? <laughs> Athena, do you actually think you or Robin could have committed this crime? Yeah, we proved how they could have. The body was moved right before the mock trial. Besides Juni, they're the only ones. And again, fucking scuttlebutt. I'm gonna be genuine. <laughs> I'm putting my foot down. <laughs> uh, Wait, okay. finish your sentence. Putting your foot down, <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm putting my foot down. That I I hate that they're not like <laughs> talking about how scuttlebutt could have been could have been a part of this. I they're like, no, yeah, she she because she was on campus during during the mock trial and whatnot, just hiding in her box. Her whole thing is about, yeah, <laughs> about yeah, yeah. being hidden and stuff. We're basically <laughs> saying that, like, to be even about things, then she should also be included as a suspect by the Fair. same logic that they are. The, yeah, but I, I, think, I think the thing <laughs> is no, that she had, she had a more solid alibi than any of these three. Yeah. Is the thing that precludes her from any of this. Okay. But also, oh, yeah, I think there. the killer... The killer, I, I think I know who the killer is, and um, I think they're just, they're, all of them are completely missing the point. They've all missed it. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Okay. <laughs> what? <I'm> <laughs> <laughs> I, point, I, just, I don't I know mean, why. I d yeah, no, I, a thought just occurred to me. Like, I, <laughs> oh. I, I don't know if. <laughs> like, are you thinking what I'm thinking? Pro probably, uh, yeah. I'm curious yeah. what you guys are thinking now, because Becca's been thinking. very firmly in the scuttlebutt camp for a while. Yeah. I I'm, I'm, I, from the very, very beginning, have I suspected Professor Means. Yeah, just because his whole shtick his whole is pretty shtick. sus. And also, like, he's never been questioned, and, um, like, why the hell would any of the students... I know. It's have like... the have the means, wink, wink, hey. or the reason, <laughs> or anything like that. Um, to and... kill their teacher. Yeah, it doesn't unless it was an accident, but I really doubt it. It is being posed as an accident. 
and um yeah nah i just yeah no that's i feel fair. like they're getting a little bit too caught up in certain bits of evidence that means mm-hmm. that they're missing other stuff that could point them in other directions because yeah because we no, don't actually know have an alibi is. for means do we yeah yeah we haven't heard Perfect. anything from him yet so um and right, um, i agree with sarah we are the players and we should theorize except for me who knows everything so <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. So no, I, I just, love I like, love hearing should... where you guys are at, and that's why I've loved Becca being like really upfront and being like, okay, I think it's <laughs> fucking scuttlebutt, and here's why. Yeah, I think I think I just mm-hmm. haven't been upfront about it because like I am still like at beforehand figuring I was still out. like yeah. Well, yeah, yeah, I wasn't. I was just it was more of a hunch than anything. Like I didn't have anything else to back it up, rather than just me going that guy's suspicious. It's more like it's more like he fits the bill in storytelling logic rather mm-hmm. than detective logic or like mm-hmm. like oh, figuring out yeah, the yeah, evidence like logic. logic. Yeah. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Like to me it's more like I've pinned him as somebody who's reading a story rather than someone who's figuring out a murder mystery. Mm, I see. Yeah, so that's why I was like, hmm, I kind of really I pinned this guy from the very beginning. Like his name, his attitude towards certain things. His place in the uh, academy, um, uh, just you know everything about him, uh, kind of screams he'd be the kind of person to probably pull this off. And I don't think he would care that he would be framing a student for it either. Yeah. Considering he's all about the yeah. means, just yeah. like everything justifies the means or whatever. And yeah. so, I. If we're looking at it this way, I feel so sad for Scuttle, but just being like so. <laughs> so turned in the wrong direction as mm-hmm. his specific student. Yeah. Oh yeah, exactly, Adam. That's what I mean. Like that's why I didn't bring it up before because as I said, it's most it's literally just a hunch based on looking at this from a story tell- storytelling yeah. point of view rather than mm-hmm. a murder mystery point of view. That's why I didn't bring it up before because I had nothing really to say from the evidence that we had been given to mm-hmm. to justify my theory. It was mm-hmm. everything else. Like, yeah, just storytelling hints rather than evidence hints. And now, now that like we're talking about it, it feels like, especially if Means is trying to take her, take Junie's case, I feel like it's one of, it's one of those things. Where, like he could use his method of yes. doing, like, like if he was the one that murdered um, <laughs> Professor Court, it's like him proving to, like, I guess himself or just in general that like his method would work. Yeah. Of, of doing whatever it, it, and if it doesn't whatever it's work necessary. then someone still gets the blame pinned on them yeah yeah and like kit and like uh kit 2.0 was saying like this is what i was also thinking about beforehand but i forgot that they also promised to end the dark age of the law something that he seems to be benefiting from mm-hmm. and liking so yeah it, yeah for him it's a win-win situation yeah mm-hmm. yeah that's just what I've been thinking, like, behind the scenes. <laughs> Any thoughts? Indeed. Alright. Um, they're the only ones who can move freely around the campus at that time. I'm sorry, Junie, but at this point, I can't rule them out. Except for this whole conversation we just had about ruling them out. <laughs> I was afraid you'd say that. Juniper is seeking a lawyer who can clear all three of their names. Only I am capable of such a feat! <laughs> but, but how can he possibly prove that all three of them are innocent? I know exactly how. <laughs> I am a result-oriented person. Uh-oh. Come tomorrow, I won't fail to have the perfect piece of evidence already. For the end really does justify the means, especially for me, Professor Aristotle Means. Of course his fucking name is Aristotle. I don't know if we knew that before, <laughs> but like, <laughs> I just... <laughs> don't you see how like I that. look like a Greek bust? I, I mean, yeah, but it's just this, this Aristotle's a piece of shit. <laughs> I am uh, a piece of shit. <laughs> Ugh, I really don't like the sound of that.
I'm sorry, but... Just as you believe I'm innocent, I believe that my friends are innocent too. Kit? Shit, Kit. sorry. I <laughs> muted myself to cough at some point. I didn't realize uh -oh. I hadn't uh, unmuted. Yeah. I don't know how much I've missed. You were just being extremely quiet this whole time. Oh, uh, no. <laughs> Fuck me. Okay. Um, <laughs> Alright. If that's how you really feel, we'll respect your decision. And Apollo? But we want to continue our investigation. Do we ask you some more questions? Sure, I don't mind. Professor Means, would you like to stay and join our conversation? I'd rather he didn't. Me neither. Yes! <laughs> of course, I am your lawyer after all. <laughs> the first time, the first time someone's lawyer <laughs> stays with them during during their interview. <laughs> right. <laughs> <You know? laughs> yeah. There's that smile again. Why does it always creep me out? Gee, I wonder. Because he shows literally all of his teeth. He looks like you know those chattering teeth thingies. Mm. Oh yeah. God, yeah. Yeah. It, yeah precisely. <laughs> Uh, about your confession, Junie. It's not true, is it? You just said what you did because Robin had confessed on the stand, didn't you? Yes. I wasn't thinking straight. Forever. I was thinking gaily. I was thinking in lesbian. <laughs> All I knew was I had to help my friend. When aren't you? You mean uh, because of that school lesbian. rule? <laughs> The one that says you can't graduate if you're convicted of a crime. I I hate to point out, but Robin did say that she said fuck it to the whole yeah. prosecutor thing, and she was going to pursue an arts career, so... No! Oh, she's, oh. She still doesn't... Oh, I, okay. I, did, I didn't do it because of some rule. I did it because she's my friend. <laughs> <coughs> Why is there discord in her voice again? She's howling at the uh, fucking moon! Athena! Oh, the summer afternoon! <laughs> Could it really be that the friendship between the three of them is on the rocks? But why? 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 There's more here than meets the eye. When did you first, uh, you three first become friends? Um, well... Oh, she looks so happy. <laughs> Even though uh, we were in different courses, we, we really bonded from the first day at school. We vowed to work together to bring an end to the dark age of the law. That was when our proof of friendship came about. Because, you know, we had like a really deep and meaningful conversation within like five minutes of meeting each other. As As it well, it sometimes that fucking happens. You just that like get put happens. together that's, in a mixer, and mean. you're like, "Oh my god, we all just vibe yeah. with each other." Shit. Oh, that's what that's what I mean. Like that's oh. literally what happened with them. Yeah. I wasn't being sarcastic. I okay, mean, like, for a second it sounded like it. I'm sorry. <laughs> no, it's fine. It's because I was saying it in her really cheerful way that it sounded mm -hmm. like that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, Phoenix. I was following. a a boy. I was following a boy. <laughs> he was it. doing the L Woods. Yeah. yeah. Uh, oh, L Woods. <laughs> We're really in it now. <laughs> <laughs> yes, you did, Deed. Good for you. Indeed. Hell yeah. Um, there's that proof of friendship thing again. I just wish this were as simple as that. <laughs> we even have proof of our friendship. <laughs> I just sighed yeah. for weep. <laughs> as long as our friendship lasts, you bet we'll be carrying them around. <laughs> <laughs> well, um. The situation kind of changed recently. Um. <laughs> when the school's policy shifted to training legal professionals who produce results. Allow me to explain. 
in the lawyer course I teach uh, producing results it means a winning trials. Suddenly got a little Italian there. I'm always a little Italian. <laughs> <laughs> a tiny Italian in my ear. <laughs> <laughs> like literally a tiny Italian. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I, I I heard a little Italian from you, and then I was like, a tiny Italian, like <laughs> just a, a small Professor Italian. <laughs> Professor Court, on the other hand, thought her finding thought that finding the truth was the only valid result. Becca. <laughs> 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 Unfortunately, <laughs> that clash of ideas created a rift among our students. At some point, we stopped talking about it. Well, that meant fewer arguments. It also meant we couldn't be as frank and open with each other as we used to be. Oh no, they discovered political divisions. <laughs> we did. <laughs> I think I understand now. By putting their friendship on a pedestal, they actually did more harm than good. Mm -hmm. It seems the relationship between the three of them isn't as simple as I thought. Juniper, thank you for talking about uh, to us about this difficult subject. Yeah, thanks, Junie. Now, if you could tell us about the day of the murder... Junie, you told us yesterday that you went home a little after 6 p.m. Was that a lie? I'm sorry I didn't tell you this before, but... What actually happened was I left the art room a little after 6 and... Headed over to my dressing room where I worked on my stage costume until 7. That's it? You didn't go anywhere else? No, nowhere else. If that really were it, then there would be no reason to lie in the first place. Yeah, and also because the, the photo that she took with Professor yeah. Court, if that was on the same day, that is. Yeah, so, that, that, um, was the, that was the very first thought that I had. I was like, how are we proving that this picture was taken on the 23rd or whatever, the, yeah. like the day before? Because like, we, have, we have the time, but just because we have the time doesn't mean that it was mm. the same day, you know? Exactly, yeah. Mm -hmm. Also, once again, Apollo, can you please tell us if she's fucking lying or not? <laughs> <laughs> My lie detection only works after I've had Burger King and uh, nobody's <laughs> bought me any, so... <laughs> Why? It's been a while since our last Burger King mission. <laughs> <laughs> Hashtag sponsored. <laughs> not. Not sponsored. Excuse me. Junie, do you remember this picture anyway? Um, yes, but something's wrong here. Wrong? What's wrong? I took this picture at around 6, was, which was before I'd left the art room. Damn, the sunset's early. <laughs> well, it is October. I guess it's so. October, but I feel like it but doesn't seem that early. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. But the clock here says it's just That's after me. 7. That was me. By seven, I'd already been working in my dressing room for some time. So there's definitely something wrong with the time in this picture. Could have been altered. Mm -hmm. Or the clock broke. Mm. That too. I guess we'd better go check that art room. Okay, just one last question about the day of the murder. On the evening before the mock trial, the evening of the murder, you ran into Hugh. Yes, I did. Oh! Her oh. little pained face. At around 7.15, I went to the main building before <laughs> going home. That's when I saw Juniper. Uh, one second. Okay. Okay, I'll be there in a minute. Uh, okay, let me finish this and I gotta go to dinner. I'm sorry, guys. Oh, you're okay. no, no worries. Problem. We didn't say much as we passed by <laughs> each other. She seemed her usual self. That's it. Anything else you like to ask? <laughs> <laughs> what is 
send off. <laughs> have a good <laughs> dinner, Rand. Have a good investigation. <laughs> are you are you gonna dinner. are you gonna come back after dinner? Do you think or I will I will try to. Okay. okay, we will we will cover you in the meantime if it comes up. But have a good dinner. Yes. Bye. 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 And then there was three. <laughs> and then there were three. <laughs> She suddenly went silent. She always was terrible at hiding things. I, but that's also a lie because she hid those other things from us the day before. Wait, oh my god. Uh, her little f- her little mouth is in like the, the, the three mouth right now. She looks like a <laughs> rabbit. It's so cute. That is cute. Aww. It's really she, she's faint just so on my cute. screen. She is. She's, she's just adorable. so cute in general. Was she trying to keep their meeting a secret by lying about going home at 6 o'clock? Alright, I won't press the matter any further. But like, why? <laughs> why? <laughs> why not? But like, why? <laughs> Is there anything else you noticed on the night of the murder? Um, well, I don't know if this will help, but... That evening, I went back to my dressing room to get something I'd forgotten there. It was well after the last bell rang. I'd say maybe around 8.30? Wow. Around 8.30, huh? That's over an hour after the crime supposedly took place. That's when I noticed that both stage statues were finished. They were quite large and they were each covered with a white sheet, but I could tell. It made me happy to think that after all that hard work, they were finally finished. Okay. Oh, right. The statues that Robin made. So they were covered in white sheets? Um. Hmm. <coughs> <coughs> Junie, are you okay? <coughs> Sorry, I'm a little tired, that's all. Wow, she went to EBDB. Uh, <laughs> considering that, uh, Athena, I think this meeting's over. Professor Means? I will use any means possible to get the result I want in Juniper's case. Uh, okay, that's not okay. That was vague enough to be concerning. Winky wink, but it will require considerable preparation, so I must be off. Apollo's 3D silhouette bothers me so much. <laughs> Sarah, me too. He's so large in 3D. Hold it! Junie, if Professor means, I have a proposal. Whoa there, I'm a widow. <laughs> what? <laughs> Not that kind of proposal! <laughs> a proposal? You gross old man. Wait, this isn't another one of your crazy- By Sunday today! Sunday today! <laughs> Sundown, don't mind Thank me. you. Uh, yes? I, Athena Sykes, along with Apollo Justice- Ooh, Wait a second, don't drag my name into- <laughs> We're going to discover the truth behind this murder mystery! Okay, yep, you're dragging my name through the mud again. Okay. What? <laughs> and we're going to bring you solid evidence showing just what the truth is. I see. So it has come to this, then, has it? <laughs> if we succeed in doing that, will you marry me? You're <laughs> <laughs> still in high school. <laughs> They're the same age, I think, right? Yeah, they're the same age. We're the they're same age, but I'm still in school, as in I'm doing work. I have to graduate. Look at it, it's just an engagement. <laughs> they can get married later. <laughs> going to jail. <laughs> Not if Athena has anything to say about it. <laughs> yeah, exactly. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> <Ooh>. <laughs> I want you to promise that you'll accept it, Junie, no matter how hard it is to hear. Um. Then you shouldn't need anyone else to defend you except me. Have we got a deal? I trust that's okay with you too, Professor Means. Hmm. I have no objections, 
As long as Juniper is satisfied with this arrangement. Okay. But only if it's the real truth. Ace Attorney 5, Becca finally gets to flirt with Ren. <laughs> 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 Fucking incredible. <laughs> Yeah, it really has been that everyone's flirted with me at some point. Except yeah, except for <laughs> Becca. <laughs> I only ever got to flirt with Rand. That's yeah. true. <laughs> Wait, I, I, I'm trying to Fra remember. Franzi. Franzi. Oh, right, right, right. Yeah, yeah. I remember now. Wait, have you flirted with Mac? What, me? No. Oh, I you have, mean yeah, Red? As, uh, as Red, White, and Gray. <laughs> yeah, okay, yeah. well, yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm trying. I'm trying to imagine and the. Also, the if he was my husband. He was my male wife. Remember? That's true. Yeah, you two were literally married at one point. Yeah, trying to figure out the ship tree. The fucking delights. Oh my god, I miss them every day. <laughs> uh, oh god. I'm sorry to put you through this, Lena. I've said your name, your nickname again, yeah. so, that know, so that the audience knows how I feel at this point in time. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. I've been thinking only of myself this whole time. That, that's not true. Yeah. 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 That's that's patently false. <laughs> um, but Junie, it's way too early to thank me. Okay, I'm begging you to upload more legally bald to the archive. Please. Okay, I do I do need to work on that. The thing that stopped me for a second was we had some um, technical difficulties with one or two episodes like right in a row um, where yeah. I had to like stop and restart stream a few times. So I was like, oh shit, now I need to like up. I, I need to pull those parts, which are each like, you know, like an hour or so together into my video editing software and smash them together so that it's one cohesive thing but i keep like because i don't have a good one for that yet i don't have like a good standalone um i think if i downloaded you... davinci resolve um okay if you need me to do that for you i will oh i i it's something that i need to i i definitely very much appreciate that i need to yeah get a powerful enough uh, editing software so that I can do that myself because there's some stuff I want to do also on the oh, side. That's fair, yeah, um, yeah. So I just if you yeah, it's me just... To just patch it up. If you just wanted me to patch it up, like real simple, and then send it off. But like, I totally mm -hmm. get wanting to just do it yourself. Like that's yeah, because totally like fair. once I have the software, it'll be easy peasy, right? I just load them all in there. It might take some time, yeah, for them to render. Yeah. But um, well, I that's the thing. Have... That's the one thing that stopped me. You know, right? It's like. Just yeah. enough steps to it that it's a task that I have not completed <laughs> yet, despite wanting to do it for several months. <laughs> I do have, I do have another thing that might help, like some, 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 some editing program links for free. Oh, please, because oh, I, yeah. I, I, like I said, I, think because I, just I remember just now that Becca also asked me for this, so I need to yeah. find them. <laughs> And I'm, re I'm remembering literally like weeks later. I'm so sorry. No, um, you're fine. The ADHD really does nerf us all, huh? It does. Yeah, no, I totally get you. Um, yeah. So don't yeah, worry, I'll get that post okay. to you. Yeah, today. please, please. Yeah, just send them in like the legally bald or something like that. Uh, I will. I will. Chat. I okay. Will. But yeah, I promise. I promise for you, Sarah. <laughs> I'll start getting back on it. Once we get past those two, again, like, after that point, they're all a single video, so I can just, like, you know, like, be like, one a day. Oh, it's time to upload this five-hour video to YouTube. <laughs> yeah. Except for that one stream that forgot to be archived. <laughs> oh, <pieces>. fucking rip! <laughs> yeah, rip in pieces. Rip to the lost stream. There was the yeah. one, the one that we do not have any longer, and it's so it's so mad maddening to me because that was also part of my Omori streaming. Because yeah. oh, really? I remember that day I had streamed like a few hours of Omori. And then I took like an extended break, like a 30 minute break in the middle and then right, just transitioned yeah. right into Legally Bald. And it was all the same stream. And I forgot to download that. And it was like the it was like the very first day of Rise from Ashes is what I do yeah. remember. It was the very first yes. time we had touched that. But that one is gone yeah, forever. We've only got like part two 
and onwards of uh, Rise from Ashes. Yeah, it's so tragic. It was tragic. one of the like, funniest ones as well. Yeah, and it was... that's, the, that's even worse. Yeah. And we only got like oh one God. clip from it too. I'm like... <laughs> Yeah, mm, what you say? <laughs> oh, true, Sarah. I I should I should add like uh, oh, this is episode one of Legally Bald, but also this is uh, you know, case one, trial two yeah. or whatever. Mm-hmm. Of yeah, Phoenix Wright is attorney. Yeah, I'll go I'll go through and uh, add some some clarification to them too. I that way I can also really easily once I get through the the original first game. I could even mm. lump them into playlists that are like, this is Ace Attorney, this is uh, Trials and Tribulations, this is uh, Justice yeah. for All, etc. So I could also make um, sp- thumbnails specific to each of like the games that we did. <gasps> if you make That'd thumbnails, be fun. I would cry. Which could help like d- <laughs> differentiate them um, between each other, like since there's so many of them. This is the Mac Apocalypse. <laughs> We're Mac voices, everyone. This is the birth of Piss Court. Oh my god, I can't even remember when Piss Court became a reality. <laughs> um, it was from the, the banana glove. Yeah, oh, banana glove. right. Okay, so. <laughs> when did we start the bitch your honor thing? That was, that was me, very like, early way on. Way back in the beginning. Um, yeah, that was, when... a- that was Ace Attorney 1. That was like Edgeworth going, <laughs> getting pissed yeah, at the was... judge. And, and then Red like, excuse um, me, bitch, your honor. Oh, yes, right. yes. Right. Yeah, it was, it was a, about, like, it was a few weeks in. Um, yeah. We were, like, probably two cases in or something. But it was it was early on in the grand scheme of things, yeah. Mm-hmm. I, I want to let you all know that bitch, your honor has plagued me so much that whenever... Me too. Uh, I hear someone say your honor in, like, a... In, in like... <laughs> Some kind of, um, you know, court like <laughs> thing. I'm like, that's not, that's not his name. That's not, yeah. that's not his title. Listen, <laughs> you have to, I, you have to say bitch. <laughs> I am terrified now of the prospect <laughs> that some point in my life I will have to go to court and address yeah. the judge, and that <laughs> I will, without thinking about it. Refer to the judge in a real life court as bitch, your honor, and oh have to God, explain like, myself. <laughs> you'll you'll have you will have jury duty exactly once, and they will never Here's ask the you to come back again. Does the jury address the the the? I almost said the bitch, your honor. <laughs> They, they they appoint I'm pretty sure they appoint one of the jury members to oh, okay. de- to declare what they had what verdict they had come oh, to or whatever. Okay. Like, but see, no, I'm they, I'm more like, I'm more we, concerned we find about them guilty of these charges and not guilty of these charges. I just have to say my power yeah. <laughs> yeah. Ren, your power. <laughs> hey, tell me more, tell me more. Did he, Did he look, look like, like a, a bitch? bitch? <laughs> tell me more, tell me more. <laughs> Did he sing like a snitch? <laughs> uh, anyway. <laughs> oh. <laughs> but you can thank me all you want once I get to the bottom of this. And you can also say yes to my proposal. <laughs> Very well. I will see you back here at the sundown. Aw, oh, this is cute in 3D. Yeah. This isn't too and bad aww. in 3D. Aww. The only good one. <laughs> Sorry for all the trouble, Professor. It's just uh, she's new to the agency, so I'm gonna pin all the blame on her. Bad I find so rather thrilling. Now let us meet here again later. I'm Bye. really sorry, <laughs> Athena, but you are the FNG. <laughs> what? I'm sorry, Athena, but you are the FNG. What? F. What is? F is in Frank, N is in Nancy, G is in Gary. What, is that, what does that stand for? I don't understand. Fucking new guy. <laughs> <laughs> I was here sitting here so confused. <laughs> what, is, what is it? F and G. <laughs> Sorry. I didn't think I was even hearing you right. I was like, what? what? <laughs> That's that's a phrase that my uh, one of my old leads would use sometimes, like affectionately, very specifically affectionately. 
<laughs> like, you know, like sometimes you, uh, he would talk about like the types of tickets that new people would get on the help desk that were always like the wildest, like what the fuck is going on type shit. Right. But it was always the new person who would get the, get the ticket and, and be like, I don't know what to do with this. And you would look at it and you'd be like, it's a fucking new guy ticket. <laughs> <laughs> If you'll excuse me, I'd better go. I'm being led away in handcuffs. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> okay, see you later. But if this trial proceeds in the same manner and ends in the same way as the mock trial? Oh. Would you not do everything you work so hard to gain? I'm trying so hard to eat these peaches. Oh my god. No! <laughs> you spare me some! <laughs> no, I can barely eat them myself, bitch! No, no! No peaches for you. Hey, there's no time to be thinking about that. I've got an investigation to do. I will find the truth by sundown, no matter what! Oh! We talk to Apollo now. Oh. Is this... Today's trial focused on the day of the crime and the actions of those involved. Yeah, like the, like when the voice was recorded and who went into the, uh, and who went to the art room and and when. God. Oh. <laughs> if we analyze the info we have, we should be able to, to ID the killer. There's no lead in these legs. I've Leg. been training for a day like no, wait, hold on. <laughs> There's no lead in these legs. I have been training for a day like this. Okay, on my mark. Ready, set. No running for me. I'm done <laughs> trying to keep up with you. His eyes are so scary. Oh god, they're stuck like that. <laughs> Fuck Stop me. staring at me like I'm that. I'm running away. I'm running away to talk to Trucy. Hi, Trucy. <laughs> I saw your debut fight, Athena. You looked like an old pro out there. I wasn't nearly that good, but thanks. Emphasis on the old. She's two years older than you. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> oh come on, you put a pip pip pipple to shame. I don't know why that was so hard to say. You'd suck your teeth in and never let go. Wait, Deej, this is what it feels like when he perceives us? <laughs> mm. <laughs> if so, no wonder everybody's freaked out by him. Jesus Christ. Yeah. Sure. Like, <laughs> Jinxie last case was like, oh my god, a demon lawyer. <laughs> like, <laughs> honestly? <laughs> honestly. Yeah, yeah. You exploited your opponent's faults and you split hairs like there was no tomorrow. You did it just like daddy would. <laughs> Okay. It was amazing. I can't tell you the last time I was on the edge of my seat for a whole fight. I I was there, apparently. <laughs> I had nothing better <laughs> to do. I have school to go to or a show to prepare for. Or... Yeah. It's spring break. Right. Uh, Apollo's face there was the first time a 3D Ace Attorney model bothered me as much as you guys. <laughs> and see, here's the thing. I don't think it bothered me. I think it, it made me laugh. I thought it was, like, really funny. <laughs> yes. And I, I'm I, because we've never seen that from Apollo before, right? The other ones I'm judging based on how they translated from 2D to 3D. That one had no 2D, um, like, uh, counterpart. So I was like, oh, I yeah. fucking love this. This is scary. <laughs> trial equal botching ma boxing match <laughs> equal trial. Amazing. Yes. Have we shown have we shown Trucy? Oh wait, we have we because have. she made that joke about making it disappear. We we're like, yeah. um, ho oh, don't. <laughs> oh, um, I wanted to Can we can we examine? Can we examine? Can we examine? It spare we examine? <laughs> it was spare we didn't we examine for me. We can't examine! No. Alas. This is so this tragic. Is so Alexa, fucking... play Despacito. Alexa, play fucking Despacito. <sighs>
Oh my god. Spotted. I've spotted her. <laughs> no, you don't. <laughs> I am not here. Is it my imagination or did something just move? <laughs> oh my god! He's oh, still here? Oh! <laughs> I didn't expect him to appear Me again. Me neither! I thought he showed up for the first half and then left! He oh, loved I can't stay away, long, away from you for not very long. Oh my god, who knew I was coming back here? We're, we're, too. we're on a time crunch! Get out of here! <laughs> what are you doing here, Clav? Ooh, Don't you think I sneaking on a campus head. like this is, is just slightly suspicious? Who says I'm sneaking? Have you know, I'm continuing my investigation in the strictest of confidence. I don't want to be caught napping again at tomorrow's trial. And that means a thorough investigation today. Think you can lend us a hand? Not fun to... Ugh. And... Excuse me, I just see Apollo and I get all blessed. <laughs> Want to refuse a damsel in distress? I just suddenly spawn into a place and I get really flustered because I did not know I was spawning into this place again. <laughs> I did not. Why could Okay, <laughs> here's a question. Why couldn't why couldn't this why couldn't this whole case have taken place uh two years two years later? Oh tragic. No idea. So fucking tragic. So fucking tragic, Becca. You see what I'm talking about, right? Yeah, I see what you're talking about. Uh -huh. It really is you're tragic. You're picking up what I'm yeah. putting down. I'm picking up what you're putting down. Thank you. I'm fucking... I'm, then I'm fucking slamming it down and <laughs> hoping other people pick it up as well. Yeah. Uh, fucking <laughs> nice, you know? It could it could have been so nice. It could have been yet, so nice. It could have been so nice. <sighs> but you needn't have asked, Fräulein. I intended to help from the start. You're the best prosecutor, Gavin. Athena, you can't yeah. feed his ego I like know. that. <laughs> Too late. I'm already doing it. I really like Listen. prosecutor Gavin. He's a great- Listen. Her forehead. I have to get in good with your sisters, okay? Uh, so excuse you. <laughs> She's my so brother. Your with your siblings, okay? <laughs> I have to get in good with your siblings, okay? Because if I'm going to marry- Oh. <laughs> I- uh... <laughs> I said nothing. I don't know why you're freaking out. Uh, Apollo just podcast. walks off with like hands <laughs> over his ears. I'm chatsy. Oh, there he go. <laughs> He's gone. Don't worry. He just has to walk that off and then he'll be back. <laughs> he always comes back. That he does. <laughs> Clavier oh, looks like he's from The Sims 4 and Apollo's from The <laughs> Sims 2! <too. laughs> you have to exclaim lovers. It will be the love. Oh my god. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> okay, time for a thorough investigation. I bet we missed lots of, missed lots of stuff yesterday. We missed lots of stuff. Yeah, I missed you half a head. <laughs> Prosecutor. I'm not here. <laughs> <laughs> Prosecutor Gavin, you were scheduled to perform at the school festival, weren't you? That's right. But I hadn't seen this stage until yesterday. That backdrop with the starry sky and big crescent <gasps> moon isn't bad. Ooh. Speaking oh. of... Oh. Interesting. Bruh. But the moon's on the other side, though. I mean, they... Also, doesn't that look mm. like Phoenix and Ed and Edgeworth? Yes. <laughs> we also had some tricks up our sleeve to make the concert really rock. Pyrotechnics, a fog machine, big banners, things like that. It would have looked like this. See, I, oh, <laughs> except it was Phoenix and Clavier. <laughs> Yeah, he, he put it back and made it made it much worse. Yeah. <laughs> oh, the plans from yesterday. What's that design on the banner there in the back? 
I know the scales are, are the school emblem. But what's with the number six? It looks like it's in serious <laughs> pain or something. <laughs> Uh, Athena, Ixne on the Ixne! <laughs> He's huh? really sensitive what? about this. Yeah, Apollo, like, ran. Uh, like, Apollo oh, sprinted no. back over as soon as he heard. <laughs> <laughs> Athena! Oh, he comes back. Hello, my Shatsi. Oh my god. Uh, that's the governor's logo, Fräulein. Oh, and the nice peak lat in her forehead. Really smooth. Mm -hmm. Oh! I, uh, I meant it looks like the number six rocking seriously hard. <laughs> yeah, Athena, no. it's uh, the, the gigantic statement necklace he's wearing. <laughs> Nine Caroline, it's a Z for governors, not a six. But whatever floats your pretty boat. Oh, you think I'm pretty? Because it's only pretty, there's nothing in it. <laughs> <laughs> so where is the banner? I don't see it anywhere on stage. It was an important part of the show, but the school managed to misplace it somehow. It's a pity. We had it specially made from heavyweight high-grade cloth. A missing banner and two broken statues. There are mysteries are plenty to be solved, yeah? Come to think of it, one of the broken statues was of Prosecutor Gavin. As you can see here in these stage plans, Right here, we have the statue of me. And right here, her right statue. But little does that matter now, as we both lie in pieces thanks to you, her forehead. What did I do? <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, Actually... you make me crumble every time you look at me with those oh big blue little brown eyes. This is not the time, Puff. It's always the time. It's, it is always, always the time. You're encouraging this, Athena? Of course, Oh my of god. Course. I'm, I'm one of the few siblings that love it when... Oh, <laughs> when look at my Shatsi <laughs> turning so red. Oh my god. I, I like seeing, seeing you suffering more than I, than I hate seeing fluffy, fluffy, duffy <laughs> shit in my face. <laughs> oh, fuck, you really are my brother. <laughs> Actually, this statue broke into rather large pieces. Why don't we try putting it back together? Maybe we'll learn something new. It's a bonding exercise <laughs> between the three of us. <laughs> Picking up these pieces of a shattered rock star? Octon! That's one uber cool idea. There might even be a song in there somewhere. I am the Humpty Dumpty in this story. <laughs> <laughs> Yay! Let's do this! Schnell! I don't know. I don't fucking Schnell. know. Schnell! Is this an investigation or am I interrupting a German language club social event? It can be both. Oh, it can be come both. on, Shatsy. You know it's always a, a German language club social event when you're with me. Wait. So he was like, let's put it together? <coughs> Okay. Let's do jigsaw puzzles together. This could be a date. Except this is an act of murder scene. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's fine. Who cares? I mean, they haven't taped it off or anything, so surely it's okay for us to be here. Yeah, it could be a date except Athena's here, third wheeling. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, Prosecutor Gavin, you're a complete wreck, literally. Why in the world would someone do something like this? <laughs> wow! It was me, I was angry at you. <laughs> I don't know, but whoever did it must have felt an amazing sense of relief. Can I take that as a confession, Hefflehead? What? No! I feel bad for Robin. She worked so hard on these. Let's pick up the pieces for her. Oh, I see you're changing the subject. You I it. am! Let's, Let's pick up check. these pieces! Let's check every corner of this stage then, yeah? And I'll oh, wait. your corners. Were there... Were there, like, loose pieces? <coughs> I found one! A piece of Prosecutor Gavin shattered pride! <laughs> <laughs> Are you saying my pride is as fragile as plaster of parrots? 
It looks like there are other larger pieces scattered about. Okay, let's find what we can. Okay. I think that's to look at the um, newspaper again, which we don't need to do. Maybe that big, that big huge piece that was just... Yeah, I don't... I don't oh, the to... rubble on the desk? The other statue Robin made has been smashed to bits. If there were some larger pieces, we might be able to put this one to get, uh, one back together too. Yeah, but Alexi are itty bitty fans. I wonder what Mr. Wright would think. Probably wouldn't fucking care. If we, if he knew we put Prosecutor Gavin's statue back together, but left his like this. <laughs> You're probably right to stroke uh, Gavin's ego more than mine. We could always come back to it after the case is solved. I'll help you fix it. Oh, it's there. A okay. Piece of rubble right there that I pointed. Okay. At yeah. <laughs> I thought you meant. I thought I'd seen one way in the back or something. <laughs> and I was like, I don't know how to get to it. <laughs> Found another piece of the statue. But there should still be some more. Let's leave no stone unturned. It looks like it would feel good to break them. <laughs> Apparently we've confirmed who is writing the descriptions for the items and it's Apollo. <laughs> <laughs> Paul's got a lot of anger. Oh, bye, going. Adam. Oh, bye, Adam. Thanks for stopping by. Hope you have a good night. Um, is there the the giant one over by the like where it originally was? Is that part of a piece? Um, like that. There's that on like the ground there. There's one on the ground back. Oh, okay. I had to pan the camera. I did not know I could do that. <laughs> Found another piece of the statue, but there's sure still some more. Oh, Let's leave okay, this is the you. same same dialogue. Yeah, this is gonna be the same thing. What about is that big piece on the floor just there, like that literal oblong piece? Oh, is that... this is this is the bag they put all the fragments in, or like the oh. there was a sheet over the uh, statues, um, right? And and that's the okay. sheet, I think. Yeah. Um, there's nothing over here. Oh, I didn't mean to examine. Whoops. <laughs> the body's gone. All that's left is a white outline. I never knew Professor Court personally, but seeing her reduced to a white outline leaves me cold inside. But in a way, she still lives on in the messages she left behind. Like the strange way her body was posed and the signs of her wrist being bound. If <laughs> Instead of, you know, the the students whose lives she touched and the teachings she passed on, yeah, I don't that's, that's Apollo, truly, what the fuck? <laughs> it's truly comforting, let me tell you. Truly, <laughs> truly comforting. Thanks so much, Apollo. Thanks. Yeah, you're welcome. Uh, <laughs> there's a reason I'm not like a therapist or anything. Maybe. Uh, wait, uh, Sarah said to keep pressing the move arrows. Yeah. Oh! Oh! oh. <laughs> and another piece of the statue. Oh, more? Oh, <laughs> what? Oh my god. I hate this hide and seek. What's going on? I don't know. This is fine for a rock concert, but the nighttime sky is backdrop for a courtroom? Possibly. I think it's breathtaking. I mean, speaking the truth, a dress starry sky, don't you think it's romantic, Fraulein? And I look at the photo. And the vein in Crescent Moon <laughs> represents the maximum three day trial cycle. He's still skulking around trying to figure out where the last pieces are. 
Three day trial of outdoors? No thanks. If it starts raining, my hair will be ruined. Because yeah. I apparently care about that. Okay. Yeah, but that's this way I can start games with a pole with her four heads while we are doing that. Oh, um, here we go. Oh, oh my god. How did I end up up there? This looks like another piece of the statue. Thanks, Apollo. This makes five pieces in all. I think we have all we're gonna find. Thank you, Sarah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's get back to where Prosecutor Gavin was shattered. <laughs> I think you might want to keep okay what's that. <laughs> okay, let's get back to where Prosecutor Gavin was... <laughs> I don't fucking know. Um, torn apart. <sighs> I was trying to think of trying to think of an innuendo, but I couldn't. <laughs> so mm. <laughs> absolutely well, destroyed. <laughs> the only one that was coming to mind was railed, and I was like, "That's not right." IDK uh, <laughs> Athena. It'll take a while to get to the courtroom where Kristoff was tried in. <laughs> <laughs> Don't like well, me bringing up on my traumatic past events. <laughs> oh, sorry, that was <laughs> Kit uh, beating up on on Clav. Apollo would never bring up Kristoff. Are you kidding me? <laughs> yeah, it's shared, shared trauma. Um, well, I don't see any other big pieces lying around. Yeah, let's see if we can put this statue back together. All right, Apollo, you come over here and prosecutor Gavin, if you could hold this. Oh look, me and my best buddies putting wow, me back together. Wow, just like new. Just yeah, five pieces. We we did it. Not bad if I do say so myself. It's almost like it wasn't shattered at all. <laughs> yeah, but don't you think it's strange? We put this statue back together, but look, what's with all these leftover white pieces? Hmm, these two look like they go together, and these pieces too. Um, Athena? What do you think you're doing? Don't stop me now. I'm having a good time. <laughs> the, uh, the, the artist having inside a me good wants time. to get out and have Having a good time. I'm shooting oh, wow. Whoa! That's a, a lot. We got a Lady Justice in here, too. So, uh, <laughs> I don't know why I'm asking what this is. It's clearly oh, a depiction. Here. What? Rand! Hi. Oh, Rand. welcome back, Rand. Hi, Rand. <laughs> Sorry, there. I have streamer mode on, so it doesn't uh, play the dings when people come back in. Yeah, how was dinner? Oh, it's okay. It was really good. My mom made surf and turf. Ooh. Oh, it was delicious. So it was like tri-tip and shrimp. Mmm. Fucking great. Mm -hmm. Well, we are investigating. We found Clavier again. We put together oh. his statue, and then from other rubble, we've now discovered a, a, a Lady Justice statue. Oh, um, yeah. Looks a little bit like Junie. Yeah. It does a bit. Ah, the, go it's the goddess of law holding a pair of scales in one hand and a sword in the other. That's quite the feat you pulled off there, Fräulein, with only three pieces of rubble. <laughs> Phew, exactly. I love that feeling you get after you work really hard on something. <coughs> no, 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 no. I know who it was. I meant to ask what it's doing here. Not sure. There's no statue like this in these stage plants. Still, I could swear I've seen this statue somewhere before. In the photo. But it was all fucked up in the photo. Yeah. Or it was in the it process looked... of being built. I guess. It Which means nothing that it's a much like earlier photo. Yeah, it's like... Huh. It's like an abstract piece. I don't know... Or it was put together in a weird way? I don't know. Like, those are her legs where her hand is coming out of. And then mm -hmm. the, the neck and the arm is down the bottom. And Can we also note there's a winch in the background here? <laughs> a what? <laughs> there's a winch. Like for a rope. A oh, yes. Mm. Like, yeah, sorry. A winch like a, like a thing that you yeah, use to yeah, like control yeah. the, the descent of a rope or something like that. I, I definitely think 
I, I, I definitely think it's going to be, this is not the photo that she took with Court at 6 p.m. This is a photo no. that was taken at a different time before the backdrop was complete, before yes. this statue was complete, that type of thing. Yeah, yeah, 100%. It's a much earlier photo. Yeah. The more we learn, the deeper the rabbit hole goes. At least if we're moving in the right direction. Let's keep searching this stage for clues. I've been wondering something about some, something this whole time. You know what pull at- hold on. You know that pull at the edge of the stage? You mean this? It has a wire that goes off and connects to something somewhere. A winch? Oh! I bet Ooh. that is the winch. Okay, um, what's this? Guido! She going to eat? Guido! An impressive building fit for an impressive school. Yeah, and these beautiful walls are like a big blank canvas. See? My shoe prints leave <laughs> real distinct marks. <laughs> face it, deface hey, it. Cut okay. that up before you get us in trouble. I meant wall, to look at the fucking banner, but okay, Apollo. Dumbass. <laughs> so the windows are different than in the photo. Are they? This fire, yeah. This fire is for hanging bangers over the stage. No, they look the same. No, I mean they're big. Oh. No, they are the same. Sorry, the windows looked. For some reason, I thought those windows were a lot smaller. Oh, no, I think the perspective is just a little wonky. Yeah, it's a perspective, yeah. One of the policemen who was here earlier was checking out how it worked. Oh, so that's why the banner looks like it's out of place. The banners are hung and removed from the art room over there. That's the art room over there? As in the scene of the crime? Bingo, Fräulein! It's too crawling with cops, so... Like little creatures. Hey! Anyone in the art room? <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh! It's you, people! <laughs> Injustice we trust! Oh my god. Why? <laughs> it's Detective Fulbright! <laughs> Injustice we trust! Is that some kind of greeting between you two? <laughs> I don't- I don't even ask, Claw. <laughs> <laughs> Detective Fulbright, can you lower that banner from there? Just leave it to me! How kind. It's like, no questions asked. Yeah, he's just like, sure. Anything for you guys. I'm but a puppy dog. <laughs> How's that? Huh, 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 Thanks, Detective. <laughs> In justice, we trust. <laughs> Always glad to help. <laughs> In justice, we trust. Since when does she like play into this? <laughs> it's it's how I get him to do what I want. So, uh, is there some kind of greeting between you two or not? <laughs> She's What's not going to answer. That? Oh. Well, oh. looks like the banner's down now. Let's go take a look. Been tied up. Um, why is it tied? Oh my god, do I have to like... Can I... Okay. Look at this banner! I don't think it would flap very well in the wind. An unflappable banner? Hey, I like that! It goes perfect with unflappable lawyers, lawyers and unflappable rockers. It's like it was made for this very stage! All right, look at this. The bottom part is all knotted up. Uh, let me try and unravel it. Ooh. Ooh. So I think we know how the body was moved. Yeah, she yeah. got. I thought something to do with the with that had to have been part of it. Like yeah. that's too mm. easy. Jeez, did you really have to? You don't come across an unflappable banner every day. <laughs> Athena, there are some things that have to yield to forces beyond themselves. <laughs> what a cruel world we live in. <laughs> oh. Hello! Oh. Come here, 
<laughs> oh nope, she's settling down beneath the desk. Alas. Okay. Okay, lady. Bye, baby. Hey, a scrap of paper was caught up inside. Uh, it's blowing away. Got it. Yes, <laughs> great catch, huh? I knew we had a drop like you around for some reason. Ooh. Looks like some kind of note. What does it say? I can't read. Baby, come back! <laughs> no. Baby! You can blame Baby, it all come back. on me. On me! October Hue 120. What's that supposed to mean? A test what score, maybe? It? Pretty impressive when you consider that 100 is a perfect score. I wonder what the rest of it says that's being ripped out. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I don't see Gio. how even Hugh can get beyond perfect. Although, Gee, it's on so although the paper, the, that little book was very narrow, so maybe it doesn't say anything, but it might say something on the other side of the paper. Mm. Ooh, maybe. We might need to see oh, like, it over. So inspect the banner again, now that it has been unraveled. Can we turn it over? We can. can we... Oh shit. <laughs> Has Scuttlebutt been listening in this whole time? <laughs> yeah, probably. <laughs> we cannot turn it over right now! <laughs> oh my oh, god! god. It'll be <laughs> That's a surprise tool that'll help us later. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> okay, Dora. <laughs> <laughs> it's actually Mickey Mouse Clubhouse. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Becca, I'm um, actually. <laughs> actually. Get your fucking children's shows right. Come on. I was a blues yeah, cruise yeah. aficionado oh my myself. <laughs> yeah, see, here's the thing. <laughs> what? What's my only thing? exposure to Mickey House Clubhouse was when Becca was a baby. It was on the TV all the time. <laughs> and I was like, I can't Mickey fucking Clubhouse stand Clubhouse. this. Uh, it's yeah, a Mickey I... Mouse Clubhouse. Come inside, there's fun inside. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, geez, it's, it's real tragic. Mickey Mouse Clubhouse is a... <laughs> it's, it's a masterpiece. <laughs> <laughs> Especially when you come, show. <laughs> especially when you come from, uh, from a um King Kingdom Hearts standpoint. <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> no. Ooh, the juxtaposition. Let me fucking tell you, Becca. Oh now you need later at a later point give a PowerPoint presentation on how Mickey Mouse Club is connected to Kingdom Hearts. I would oh love to hear it. I would so love funny. I would love to. If my ADHD allows me to remember, I surely will. <laughs> Holy shit. Um anyway, um this is the emblem that's on Jeannie's school uniform. It's almost like it's the school the school uniform in general. <laughs> because I can only think about Jeannie. Yeah. I can only ever think about Jeannie. <laughs> I have, have lesbian. I'm constantly thinking in lesbians. Ace Attorney pulls the exact same tricks, and the protagonists are exactly shocked the third time around as they were the first. The prosecutors beat up the attorney so they forget the plot. This symbol is on my girlfriend's boob. Hey, I recognize that. Hey! You're right. Wait a sec! It's hard to see against the red material, but look. There's a dark red stain here just under the emblem. This banner was on a wire connected to the art room. Right, and the art room is where the murder occurred. Are you <laughs> thinking what I'm thinking? The stain might be from the victim's blood. Oop. And I oop. Oopity doop. Let's oop, look oop. at the statue now. This statue doesn't look like you or Mr. Wright. The goddess bearing scares and a sword. She's a symbol of fairness and strength. Strength. Ooh. But she and her symbols were shattered with the statues of you and Mr. Wright. Oh, you you know what? I but. bet they were. It just occurred to me. I don't I don't remember how or why they were shattered, but like 
were they shattered because the person uh, who did the murder, like, um, ferried the the body down across the wire and the body, like, smacked into them that to knock sense. them over and shatter them? Yeah. I bet that's that what happened. Sense. It's a pretty strong body. <laughs> well, I mean, gravity. dead weight yeah. and gravity and <laughs> momentum. Like the, the, the statues obviously didn't get toppled over and then smash on the ground. Like, this, the base of them is still on the pedestal. Right. So that, that indicates yeah. that the body then crashed through them like a you bullet would bill. Think, you would think there would be wounds on the body then, you know? Yeah. That's yeah. just true. It, surely it wasn't... Like, I, I guess they it did. depends on how quickly after death it was moved, but like... Or it was the, 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 um, justice statue, the, the, oh, like, the lady yeah, that. that got swung down first. Oh. Yeah, see, it says no other visible damage, but yeah, the body definitely would have been damaged on the way down. They, I, when you said that, I then, they, they had mentioned at the very beginning, like, oh, she was, like, very carefully transferred because there wasn't yeah. any like sign that the body had been dropped from then how uh, did the blood get on the banner mm. unless, unless I mean down. they're plaster of the Paris not statue. stone that's true plaster is like uh you can break that pretty easily yeah yeah but you still get lasting damage so I'm wondering if maybe the other statue was the one that was carted down first mm -hmm. oh yeah and that could have been it and then they dragged the banner back up and then took the body down. But then it's yeah, like, like, why would they, they move saw... the statue? I was gonna say maybe they saw that the that the statues were in the way, so they were like, "Oh, I'm gonna I'm gonna send this down to break it or something, get it out of the way, <laughs> clear clear the path of travel." <laughs> yeah. I don't know. Anyway, uh, this is a direct challenge to the rule of law. Well, if they want to fight, they've got one. Hmm. The amount of times that Apollo calls her tiger. <laughs> yeah. I think that's kind of cute. It is kind of cute. cute. <laughs> it's a cute nickname. It is. Whoa, take it down a notch, tiger. <laughs> Let's save the fighting for when we find our culprit. She's orange. It makes sense. I did not even think about that. I was like, <laughs> she's yellow. No, yeah, the <laughs> tiger is out of her cage. Yeah. Yes. 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 She claws. is free. <laughs> Oh, that was a whole lot of poking around in such a short time. Does that mean you're satisfied? Actually, uh, there was one more thing I wanted to check out. See that metal fence back there? There's just one. There's just that one segment, so it seemed out of place. It looks like they were in the process of removing them after this stage was set up. But they were never able to finish an account, or on account of the murder. We should take a look if you think it could be important. Ooh, something was there. Hmm, this track looks man-made. Hey, you're right. And it looks like it starts from behind the backdrop. Maybe a big money pro wrestler was hiding back there. That was the last case, Athena. Oh, my mistake. Well... Uh, we'll never know until we take a look. Oh. Mm. Looks like something was being dragged through here, and this is where it started. Gee, I fucking wonder. What it, what could it have possibly been? Mm. Yeah, but whatever it was, it's long gone. Must have been pretty heavy. Perhaps it was used in setting up the school festival. Uh, then I guess it wasn't a pro wrestler. Still, this could be something important. Well, that's about it for the stage. Right, I think we'd better search the art room next. <laughs> if Fulbright lets us in. We <laughs> will <laughs> hang around here for a while, but make sure to tell me once you find it, yeah? Put them next to each other, you cowards! Let me see Cole follow together on the same screen! <laughs> Let me see the juxtaposition uh, of Apollo being the same exact height as. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Don't let me see that. That's not right. I also it's wasn't not right. right beside mine, Shatsy. It's it. It's <laughs> not natural. <laughs> Shrink I this love, man. I love the the term her, of endearment. Her forehead. Her forehead. Come over here. I must give you a kiss. What? Why? Okay. 
I'm here. Come here. No, stop, stop, stop running away. Come here. No, Wait. I'm here. I, I said I'm here. I'm not walking away from you. Oh. Okay, okay what, what do you want me here for? Mwah. <laughs> Apollo just turns into a robot and marches off screen. I don't know who's <laughs> reading his lines now. <laughs> oh, look at him go. Oh, oh he's so funny. So easily flustered. It's great. Look, look do you see the way he starts to creak? He really yeah, it's so funny. Widget, Widget is yes, reading Widget. his lines. <laughs> okay, I got you. <laughs> what else? Is it Kafani's banners that disappeared from the stage? I like to think that Apollo is actually just shouting them from afar. <laughs> <laughs> it's like he like he like he like like uh like kind of like robot very stiffly marches over somewhere out of sight like behind a fence or something. Uh, and then, but it's still listening. <laughs> you never oi. You never oh, know. Sorry. It just might be connected to the case at hand. Oh shit. <laughs> Uh, Don't tell me. So in short, really? Or does or does he just want his banner back? In short, oh. that. Clav frown. So <laughs> angry. Mm -hmm. Hey. <laughs> yeah, it's almost like she's been here the whole fucking time. Uh, that box. It just took off running. I, I have no clue who that could be. <laughs> I have a pretty good idea of who it is. As I suspect you do too, no matter what you say. <laughs> yeah. Come on, we can't afford to have any weird articles written about us. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's a little late for that, Athena. <laughs> the maintenance Not area is dream. over in that direction. After that box. Bye, hey, Claw. Do you reckon... Do you reckon? Oh, bye, mine Shatsi. Oh, oh, there he go. He's still robotic. <gasps> the cat. What did we name the cat? I think it's her. Do you guys reckon that um that uh, Scuttlebutt is just that meme where it's like he became long boy. How how are he do it? <laughs> <laughs> how are he do it? <laughs> but like, but like, she has become a hermit crab. How are she do it? How are she do it? Ginkgo! <laughs> yeah, no, I she's drafting. said Ginkgo. Oh, I Wait, didn't hear you. I'm sorry. And I just said Ginkgo. <laughs> I think Wait. you both kind of like got drowned out in the general Maybe. chaos. Is Ginkgo um, yeah. the cat? Ginkgo's the cat. Oh! We named um, him Ginkgo. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, one. Scuttlebutt is furiously drafting up her next article. Does Clavier Gavin is gay? <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. She's got I a know, new. A she got a new box. Oh my god! Did Simon actually destroy her old one? I think he did. I sweated through it. I I I, I sweated through it. I have to get a new one like every day. You know how you change clothes? Duh. I'm you were so proud of that that one box, but okay. Yeah. Miriam, you're liable to get tossed in the garbage truck if you hang around here. I'm just an empty box, and that's and that's what you do with them. You just throw them away. Crime cleaner? <laughs> <laughs> Wipe the past hey, clean! did you change boxes? I like the new look. What does it matter anymore? I was a complete failure in court today. My work, my pride, my dreams, everything I've worked so hard for, gone. Ew, stop sweating through that box. That's nasty. No nasty can doctor. do. <laughs> Sorry, Miss Scuttlebutt, but... But, but... Doesn't believe in you had a scoop when you really didn't make you a failure as a reporter? <laughs> Athena tore her down. <laughs> failure? As a reporter? Cuck, cuck, cuck. <laughs> Appeared! Wow, reveal! Wow. Wow. wow! Come to think of it, calling her a failure as a reporter might have been a bit extreme. <laughs> Why is he smiling at that? Because he thinks it's fucking funny. <laughs> <laughs> He's right, too. 
sis, 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 sis. Scold me, despise me, pack me away, where I'll never see the light of day. I've been cast aside to waste away into a big pile of mushy paper mache. I kind of feel responsible for this, but it's also really fucking funny, so... <laughs> Now's our chance to prod her for information while she's vulnerable. Quick! <laughs> I bet that's what you were just thinking. What kind of person do you think I am? You read me like a fucking book. <laughs> yeah. I'll do it again. Scuttling scuttleplay. <laughs> oh my god. That was you on stage earlier, wasn't it? Why'd you run off like that? Apollo, use your freaky stare on her! Quick, Athena! Gaslight Gatekeep Girl Boss! <laughs> Take a look... at this. Why are you showing me a burnt-up old rag? Oh, that's the banner! Oh, yeah! Wait, it's really hard to see, but I think that's the Gavineer's logo there. So, is this the banner that disappeared? It's all burnt up. D don't look at me! I just happened to find in the incinerator. Incinerator? Did Blackwell actually make a good- make good on his threat to burn her box? We were just talking oh, about I, this! Literally, I think he did. <laughs> I made fool right to do it. We should probably try to find out whether someone tried to destroy this on purpose. Yeah, this banner is sounding less and less unrelated to our case, Apollo. The depth of despair. <laughs> um, <laughs> Miriam, I owe you an apology. I shouldn't have said that you were a failure as a reporter, even if it was fucking funny as hell. <laughs> <laughs> Too late. I already decided journalism isn't for me. Apparently, I can't even take one criticism. How will I ever go into the world of journalism? Yeah. The last step is to erase all of the photos on my PC. I'm really going to do it! Here it goes. 5%? 10%? Four years of my life down the drain. Uh, shouldn't we stop her, Athena? No, that's like incriminating stuff on people. Miriam, you should keep your publish- you should keep publishing your paper. I didn't mean what I said, okay? You didn't mean it? Oh no, my <laughs> photo! Stop! Cancel! Abort! Did you stop it in time? Deletion progress. George. 99% complete. There are only two pictures left. This is, this, is, this, is, this, is, this is. What are you going to do now, Athena? You owe it to her to make this right. Do I? <laughs> yes. <laughs> I, mean, I, I did kind of do it myself. I mean, hey, I didn't make her. I didn't make her give up on reporting. Like, like, she, if you really can't take a critique, like a singular critique, she really shouldn't be in this <laughs> in this career. <laughs> but uh, don't worry, Miriam. Your photos may be gone. But the memory of your photographic genius will live on forever in all of our hearts! Uh, Athena... That was cringeworthy. I oh, fucking like inside you better. cringe! <laughs> I, would, I, I wouldn't have cringe, done worse! I'm free, Apollo! Can no. you say the same thing? Not yet. <laughs> hey, <laughs> Miriam, check this out! You took some amazing photos of the three of them. I'm sure they really appreciated it. I'm sure they did. <laughs> hmm. Obviously, I'm the ace member of the newspaper club. The only member, in fact. I know this will make up for the photos you lost, but here are your newspapers back. We clearly don't need them again. <laughs> wow. There is no rest for the wicked. I plan on pursuing those three for as long as I live. Oh, wow. Lord. Okay. That's honey, bad. Honey, you're not going to be invited to the polycule. I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm sorry. It's I, not going to happen. I'm so sorry, that's me. Miriam, why are you so obsessed with Juniper, Hugh, and Robin? 
She just wants what they have. Yeah. Uh, uh, obsessed? I'm not obsessed with them. It's just they were so close ever since their freshman year. So, uh, well. She just wants to be their friend. Mm, she's got oh. a bad way of doing it, though. She's yeah. Learned not to do that. <laughs> yeah, it's it's not. <laughs> At least if you come out of the box, they might. You are pretty cute. She is so cute. Oh, my God. Mm -hmm. And I, I cannot get over the binder clippers as her <laughs> hairpins for her pigtails. Oh, wait, shit. Uh, Athena, are you thinking what I'm thinking? Yeah, I think that's the only ex uh, explanation. Wait, 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 wait a second! You're not thinking what I think you're thinking. Objection! That's exactly what he's thinking, Miriam. You want in on their little polycule! <laughs> <laughs> what? How could you possibly know that? You're not exactly... <laughs> so cute! <laughs> you're not exactly subtle, let's be real. I am the most subtle person you've ever met. so tired. <laughs> That's one abused laptop. My laptop won't turn on. Never thought my life would end so soon. A mere 17 years. <laughs> now I really feel bad. Oh, I know! Miriam, we have a laptop at the office. We'd be happy to lend it to you. Why? <laughs> I'm just gonna give you uh, Mr. Wright's laptop. Oh no. Oh lord. Huh? Y you have a laptop I could steal? Sure, but on one condition. I want you to ask Junie, Hugh, and Robin if you can hang out with them. After this trial. <laughs> what? What? Like I could ever do that? It's better than you just creeping, creeping on them. It, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, but that's the deal if you want to borrow our laptop. What? <sighs> you scare me sometimes, Athena. You're like good cop, bad cop roll <laughs> rolled into one. Thank you. What? <laughs> oh, fine. Fine. I'll do it if that's what you want. Yay! I'll be by later to bring you the laptop. Wait, it's not like I owe you anything, but here. Oh, thanks. Oh, it's a set of pictures. Looks like they're setting up the stage. Ooh. Oh, that was you. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh. oh, yeah. I, I took them when they were putting the stage's backdrop into place. Oh, looks like they're setting up the stage. <laughs> Wow, you sure have an eye for photography. From what I can make out, anyway. <laughs> what do you know? <laughs> look, at, look, it's the background. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> In the window. <laughs> right at 6.01 p.m. Huh? Uh -huh. Interesting. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Mm -hmm. These are the last two photos that didn't get deleted. You know, by coincidence. Thank, They're thank all yours. fucking god. <laughs> You literally just sh saved my entire ass. <laughs> well, it's what I do. God. <laughs> well, see you around, scary lawyer lady. All right. That was really impressive, Athena. What's next? Well, I'd like to talk to Hugh or Robin, if possible. R at I would like to talk to Robin, actually. I don't fucking care for Hugh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's walk around and see if we can find him. <laughs> Wait. If Scuttlebot got on in the poly, it wouldn't be 50 50 lad last anymore. A disturbance in the balance. <laughs> <laughs> It's okay. It's it's two lasses and one lad, unless we're going with gender fluid Robin, which I guess can count. But I think Scuttlebutt yeah, can they, count they, as a box. <laughs> I mean, we don't know about Miriam. That's true. She could be an egg. We are we are assuming. Yeah. We are assuming. 
I'm Arrow Ace, and I just want to get in for like the quick platonic. Yeah, she just wants to be their friend. That's fair. Yeah. Hey, that's Why you over there. Talk? Great. Yeah, try and sound more enthusiastic, <laughs> Athena. <laughs> Hugh, we wanted to have a word with you, if you don't mind. If it was Mr. Right, <laughs> then sure, but you two? Mm. Well, too bad, we're gonna talk to you anyway. Wow. I don't want to talk to you. I knew it. There's a hint of discord in Hugh's voice. He is once again howling at the moon and sleeping in the middle of a summer <laughs> afternoon. You're not getting off that easy. <laughs> After all, you're a possible suspect. Plus, you actually confessed in court. Whatever. So, what do you want from me? Wait, yeah. They confessed, but only Junie's the one in the detention center? Yeah! Right? I think it was because of the whole, like, Oh, they're just doing it to try to protect each other. We don't actually take this seriously thing. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Hey. Dre, you're the only person who said Hugh, my beloved. I, Hugh, I'm my beloved. <laughs> yeah. He. <laughs> but make it brief. I don't have a lot of time, and I assume you don't either. I have all the time in the fucking world, bitch. Why the fuck what did you don't get that, you little bitch? Fucking case, bitch. Hey, you don't get to call me bitch. Um, yeah, don't. You don't, don't get to call her bitch. bitch. Yeah, then she doesn't get to call me bitch. No, that's not how this works. <laughs> yeah, that's no, it yeah, is how like... it works. Otherwise, I'm walking away. <laughs> it is a term. Uh, listen, I can't control. I can't. I can't control the. I can't control this tiger. And honestly, you've been in court, right? You're a law student. It's a term of respect. <laughs> clearly, can't you tell by the way that I'm saying it to you, bitch? Bitch. Yeah. It's clearly, you can it's clearly respect, respect in her bitch. voice. Bitch. Like, yeah. Yeah, bitch. Bitch. Uh, bitch. Oh, I'm bitch. So bitch. Sorry. <laughs> bitch O'Connor. <laughs> bitch oh bitch. It's you oh bitch. Bitch. <laughs> bitch oh bitch. <laughs> bitch bitch bitch. Okay, we need to get to bitch. <laughs> okay. <laughs> about your confession out. today, bitch. You weren't really serious about that, were you? <laughs> bitch. You <a> bitch. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> Now. <laughs> Let's just say I had no choice thanks to a certain lawyer who failed to get the job done. Bitch. <laughs> so you're really prepared prepared to take the blame for this? Not gonna happen. The voice on the tape is female, so that rules me out. Let's put it this way. You don't actually believe that ridiculous play on words, do you? No, I fucking do. Yeah, I do. Well, my confession is just like that. A means to an end. Or as we say around here... The ends justify the means. Ugh. But I actually do believe the voice is shouting Hugh O'Connor. Juniper's confession was quite advantageous for the real killer. But if Robin and I were actually the killer, we wouldn't have confessed. It's that simple. Even you should be capable of such reasoning. Or have I overestimated you? Bitch. You'll make a great lawyer someday. I mean, you sure seem to enjoy getting under people's skin, bitch. Thanks. <laughs> Could you and Robin's confessions really prove their innocence instead of their guilt? This is gonna take some serious thinking on my part. Wait, Phoenix, like, I know this is hypocritical of me, of me, but no, yeah, we need to make sure this guy doesn't get his badge. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. What's the hot sauce? <laughs> It sure looks like Prosecutor Blackhole was twisting your arm to testify earlier today, bitch. That's true. He had some hot goss on you. What was that about? Yeah. Is there some Ooh. sort of secret he's using against you, bitch O'Connor? I have no intention to say anything more. <laughs> now, if you'll excuse me. Now you won't! Oh, I'm going to throw a baby hissy fit! <laughs> I am not through with you, just. <laughs> I can't believe I went so 
It seems like the rogue prosecutor has it out for me. <laughs> Leave, and we might just discuss you know what. Okay, Mickey Mouse. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to give a British accent with that pitch, okay? <laughs> no, wait. One little statement and Mr. Crow loses it? What's that all about? I changed my mind. I'll stay and testify. You really are a rank amateur. Even if that were true, you think I'd open up to you? So he's not denying it, little bitch. That secret might be causing the discord in his voice. That's me. <laughs> that's me. Uh, that's me. Never mind. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> then again, we have the same problem with Junie and Robin. You're just wasting your time and mine. Next question. About that meeting with, Profe uh, with Professor Court on the 23rd, why did she want to see you? Bitch. <laughs> I'm no intention of telling you. You have to force the enemy any way you can. Ugh. Professor Means strikes again. <laughs> then again, Hugh is Bless in the you. lawyer course. Thank you. But didn't Professor Court used to say that the only good result is the truth? So why don't you drop this whole charade and just tell me the truth, you little bitch? The truth? How can you be so sure it will help you solve this case? Truth isn't necessarily your friend. Or Junipers, for that matter. No, you're wrong! I don't care what anyone says. I'm going to defend Juni the right way, using the truth. That's the only way you- I- That's wrong. That's the only way to honor Juni's wishes in Professor Court's memory. I see. <sighs> Very well, Miss Sykes. I'll testify tomorrow about that truth. You're so- interested in you but <laughs> don't look to me if something happens to juniper because of it understand what dude you can that would be taken in so many wrong ways you yeah. you what the fuck yeah that's what's like a threat. that's supposed to be <laughs> What a terrible thing to say. I thought you guys were friends. Yes. We were. Until just recently, actually. What? What Dude, the hell? We were? I already told Jupiter, so I might as well tell you. I don't really care about her anymore. Bro! Uh, why? Why? Also, how, could you, how, how could you hate Juniper? Just as I have my secrets, she has a side you've never seen. That's a lie. Yeah. I've seen every side of Juniper. Well, have you? Oh my god, Wait. can you stop being a fucking lesbian for <laughs> one second? <laughs> no, I can't. You not look like that, dude. Can you just quiet down your lesbianism for one second? No. Uh, anyway. <laughs> Juniper's not all sunshine and rainbows like you think she is. What are you saying? This conversation is over. I said I don't have a lot of time, and I meant it. Literally, where you could you possibly be going? Hugh, Maybe I'll wait. be revealed later. Uh, he's gone. He doesn't care about her anymore? Oh, why would he say that? And literally, how is that physically possible for someone to not care about Juniper? That I feel like it's so a well. lie. I guess we'll just have to pin our hopes on his testimony tomorrow. Athena, what do you say we head over to the art room? Might be a nice change of pace. <laughs> Gee, I wonder who'll be there. <laughs> Hopefully the police haven't completed their investigation and we definitely won't run into Fulbright or anything. Alright, we really, uh, we don't really have much time left anyway. Um, uh, here's a question. Mm -hmm. It looks like we've got a chunk of, uh... Yes. Investigation mm -hmm. left. So do we want to end it off here as a convenient? I feel yeah. like... E... Or do yeah, we have... I'm getting, I'm getting very low on battery, so... Yeah. 
seems I, like a good idea. I am also Ooh. kind of losing losing steam, so uh, I think this yeah. is a good place to um, break for the night. Um, let me make a save state. Save state. Save state. Save state. Save state. Shoot, what's the, what's the little jingle for this one? Is there a jingle for Dual Destinies? Oh, there is, but I can never remember it. It's not <laughs> It's not as memorable as some of the old, uh, earlier yeah, ones. Yeah, like... <laughs> ba -da -ba -ba -ba. That's McDonald's. <laughs> No, no, it's not. That's there was like a character. That was not McDonald's. <coughs> that was like the first. I think that was the first one for Phoenix Wright Ace Attorney. Like, I, it, it might have been one of the earlier ones. I think it was something similar, but the way you just sang it was just the McDonald's theme song. <laughs> but I think I I I believe you when you say it's like similar. Okay. <laughs> anyway, thank you so much, everybody. Uh, <laughs> I managed to walk away to get food and came back, and you were still in the detention center. Yeah, we were. Yeah, um, yeah we were. We were hanging out. We were, we were real you guys slow. Were when I got back, I was like, oh. Yeah, so we were kind of. We were kind of taking our sweet time tonight. Um, but that's okay. Um, but yeah, thanks so much, everybody, for stopping by tonight. Um, really appreciate y'all hanging out with us. Um, let's go raid uh, Paintbrush Tales, PBT, again. Very lovely streamer. Um, they are, I'm not, actually, hold on, I'm not sure what they're doing. The stream category says Calico. I don't know if that's a, a video game. Or what? I'm I'm investigating. <laughs> oh, it's a cat game. It's just not the cat game. <laughs> anyway, let's go let's go raid her. Go show her some love. Give her a follow. Uh she's a very sweet uh person uh and streamer and whatnot. So um I hope you all have a lovely time zone wherever you are. Um I will see you guys. I'm thinking I might start streaming on Monday nights um, at some point to I I want I want a more regular thing. I know it overlaps with Max a bit, but um I was like I need to I I want to do 3 days and I can't just do like other weekend days cuz that's when I plan everything else in my life. So mm -hmm. um Monday it is. So um, hopefully I will see you Monday. I think I'll be playing Yakuza that day. Um, oh, but yeah. Oh. Um, Max streams every day of the week, so you kind of have to. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, yeah. But Max streams like Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, mostly. Well, uh, yeah, but I already stream Wednesday, Friday. So if I want to stream day, that's not the weekend. I have to overlap. True. So. But that's fine. Um. But yeah, um, sorry, I had to cancel that because the count the countdown was was happening. Um, oh, fair. So anyway, I love you all so much. Thank love you for you stopping too. by. Thank you, my friends. Thank you. <laughs> Good night, everybody. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Have a great night, uh, rest of your night. Take care of yourselves, and we'll see you around. Bye, -bye. Bye everybody. Good night. Bye. Good night.